Confusion X. I see you coming in there with the follow right at the beginning of the stream. I am just finishing up setup and we will be starting soon. Thank you so much for the follow. Also, for those who followed while I was offline, in case you are in the chat, Les Jours French, Cosmic Knight 101, and Brave Flash 11, thank you for the follows as well. We should be live here playing some webbed in just a minute. Also, getting up is extremely overrated, and I highly recommend against that. Uh, getting up requires moving and leaving your bed, both of which are activities that I do not recommend on a daily basis. <laughs> I don't think you realize I work from my bed. My laptop sits beside my bed. The only time I leave my bed is when I don't have food sitting next to it or when I need to get to my computer, which lives in the kitchen, <laughs> which is right beside the food. I like the setup. It works for me. So, so what you're telling me, Steve, is that not only are you making the mistake of getting out of bed, you're getting out of bed and going into this mythical place they call outside. Also, I missed last bin day, so I feel you. My bin is overflowing right now. It's not great.
All righty, hello everybody. We are cutting the loud music now for just the game music because we are going to be playing Webbed. The best way I can describe this is what I did in the title, which is basically this is the game where that beautiful little animated spider that everybody loved gets to dance. And then he gets his own game. And I love, um, yes, it is the physics spider game. I am so excited. I am going to fail. <laughs> the developers would like to acknowledge Jagra, Turbul, and Gooby Gooby Peoples as the traditional owners of the lands on which Webbed was produced. That's cool. The little sounds. Sleep is overrated. Okay, I'm starting to learn how the game works already. Let's go. I love it already. Shoot the webs. Wait. How do I do this? I'm I, I'm at a loss. Oh, we'll figure that out later. So cute demon. If you want to stay up and watch, you are more than welcome to. It is not necessary though. I watched a tiny bit of this game earlier and I regret it already. <laughs> I love that we can shoot straight up lasers. No, the pretty little blue baby. Oh baby. Yes, I got so insanely lucky. I have recently had the opportunity to work with the Indie Game Collective. They have decided to let me be in here. And uh, yeah, they are an amazing, amazing group that uh, hooks up a lot of indie gamers with keys. And I am lucky enough to be a part of them. So yeah. We are now, uh, so I, I, they were, they were able to hook me up with this key, and, uh, I'm very excited. Hey, buddy, I'm so sorry. I thought what happened to your boyfriend. That big mean bird has been menacing the land below the sky bower for years. It devoured many of my siblings, but I think it has something else in mind for your boo. Boo? I think, we're gonna call it boo. I forget how you pronounce that word. The bird loves to collect blue gems, you see? And that love of yours is the shiniest blue I've ever seen. <laughs> Come by my old nest, little buddy. I may have an idea. Tonight's stream is brought to us by a two liter of Diet Coke that I'll be chugging throughout the entirety of this because I'm running on six hours, no, five hours of sleep in the past two days. Okay, so this big ball of silk may not look like much, but it was my home for a time. The ants below have approached me with reckless plans to turn it into a heated airship as part of their defense effort. I've not let them try so far, but perhaps a little recklessness is what we need right now. If you help them build this ship, it could take you to the Sky Bower above to rescue your boyfriend. You'll need some fuel too, of course. I'd look in the dung beetles. I'd look to the dung beetles on the hill for that. And naturally, a guide is important for any adventure. Perhaps a bee? Nobody knows this guy better than them. Yes! Yeah. This is a good plan. Go on, little buddy. There's no time to waste. Get out there, make some friends, and save your love. Okay. I think this is where I need to go down. They're not super clear on what you're doing here. And I'm already super lost. 
you to shoot lasers. Ha ha. Okay. Listen, face it, that's, that's so cute. <laughs> this is literally one of the cutest things I have ever seen. Okay, so there's no way up there right now. You can fly up the bus. <laughs> this is just gonna be me fangirling the whole episode. <laughs> It so much. I'm assuming this is the ant hill. <gasps> yes! Greetings, Comrade Spider. I hear you've got some problems that you could use an ant solution. Wait, did my mic break? Did it break? Is it better now? Did it fix itself? Let's check my mic real fast. Properties. It's using the right mic. I don't know. Stuff likes breaking sometimes. I don't think it's using the wrong stuff. My music is a bit loud though, it seems, so we will turn that down a little bit. Uh, it's still looking a bit loud, so we're gonna turn it down a little bit more. Okay, negative 21 looks okay. Is my mic working now? It's showing working on my end. I am still very new to this. This is my seventh or eighth stream. It's whatever number of streams you need to get affiliate, guys. If we have a good stream, we might actually uh, get uh, affiliate after this, which would be pretty epic. I've heard you've got some problems that could use an ant solution. <clears throat> We'd love to help out, but we're still recovering from the latest fire ant raid. The workers could really use some extra help down there if you've got time. Speak with Comrade Carl in the mech ant chamber. She'll be able to give you some work. <laughs> I love that they're... <laughs> Comrade Carl. not fall too hard i'm guessing oh, there's lovers and stuff i love it you here to help with the elevator it's been broken down since the attack but i can't reach the part we need to fix it if you can get me the brass cog from the other side of this chamber we should be able to get it running without that elevator we're stuck up here Okay, so we need a brass cog. I'm assuming, oh uh, yeah, this this makes sense. Ha! Ah! I love it so much. This is very difficult, and I am not good at physics. I do not know how to do the physics thing. What? What the what? How do I get up here? <laughs> I'm struggling. There. That's good enough for me. We're building webs, guys. I can't really crawl on top of it. It's so bad. My poor little baby boy. <laughs> I hurt my darling baby. I feel so bad right now. How do I even push this that far? I'm guessing I just have to keep pushing it, maybe? I'm very confused as to how this works, but this is literally the cutest thing I think I've ever played. Do I just have to keep on slowly pushing it? Can I pull it with webs somehow? Can you come with me if I pull you? I don't think I'm pulling it. I don't know how this works. Maybe if I put a web from like here to here, that'll help it. There we go. That's helping. We're making progress, boys. Nope, we just undid all of our progress. Nope, that's not what we want. That's definitely not what we want. Okay. We're gonna attach one end to you. And then we're gonna run all the way over here. And we're gonna attach another end over here. Will that work? No. I don't know how this game works. It's very difficult. Yes, I know I'm supposed to fire the lasers to some extent, but I don't know how to get this cog up the hill. My little guy is struggling. He's dancing though. I love him so much. Let's try taking off all the webs. Not like this. Ah, okay. We're up a little further. Come on. 
Slowly push it. Slowly push it. Come on, please. Ew. Okay. We're getting somewhere. I think we're learning how this works. We're slowly getting it up the hill. Come on. Come on. <laughs> We've made progress. Go, little thing. Go. There's so many spider webs everywhere. <laughs> Take your cog, my lady. I gave you a female voice. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, comrade. I'll deliver the cog back to the main shaft. That was way more difficult than it needed to be. Just pop it into the gearbox and we should be good. Back to the main shaft we go. I'm assuming that's the one over here. Yes, it is. Okay. So now, we need you over here. It's literally the cutest thing I think I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Love it. Ooh, another... I'm guessing that's a spider link? Spider baby? I wonder if there's fall damage in this game. I don't really want to find out. I'm sort of scared to find out, not gonna lie. I'm assuming we need to flip this lever. Yes! Yes, I found a thing. I love this so much. This is literally my new favorite all-time game. I, I don't even know why. It's literally just the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I don't know where we're going or what we're doing, but we're doing something. Oh, we made a passage. That makes sense. <laughs> I may never play anything else ever again. Like that's this, it's, it's that bad. It's this cute. I love, I love, I've literally watched hundreds of hours of this dang dancing spider and now he has a game and I am in love with him. And I want him to have my little spider babies, if I could have little spider babies. <laughs> uh, I'm a horrible human being, I know. We have another little spiderling! Okay, nowhere to go up there. I love that you can climb on vines and stuff and make these intricate webs and... I'm in love! <laughs> I'm not going to find out, demon. I like my spider of life. <laughs> it's so cute! <laughs> There's more ants! Greetings, comrade. Did comrade Mark recruit you from the surface? Fantastic! There's tons of work to do to finish the mech ant. Let's see. The mandibles need a final heat treatment in the forge room. But to turn that back on, we need to patch up the pipeworks. We'll need that to supply the mech ant too. Oh, and it still needs three more legs to be attached. I think we're waiting on the deliveries for two of them from engineering. Well, what are you waiting for, comrade? Get to it! Okay, so this is Pipeworks. Makes sense with the whole, you know, pipe going on there. Okay. I don't know which way we're supposed to go first. I love it, though. Okay, so I don't think we can go that way yet. Let's see. Let's learn how to jump. That might be helpful. Oh, no! My baby! <laughs> My poor little spider baby! I'm sorry, my precious spider child. How do we get down there? I'm so confused and lost right now. Is there even anything to like attach to down there or am I just killing myself for no reason? I'm so sorry, spider baby. He's so cute. No, okay, you can't go that way. Okay, now we know I feel really bad now. Let's try to get over to electrical. I'm just murdering my spider baby for no reason. And how can you be afraid of this adorable bean? Okay, so we need another cog for there. Let's not clog that up with webs. Okay, so. Hello. Ouch. This mudslide is getting dangerous. I was trying to repair this power station to open up access to the pumps, but I slipped and fell. 
Could you lend me a mandible? Absolutely, little buddy. You just need me to make you like a web? Is that what you need? I think I need to break that one. I can't tell what I'm supposed to do. No, I trapped myself. <laughs> I'm. Please free me. Okay, there we go. I freed myself. Is there any way for us to get out of here? We can get out from here. Break this. So we want to get around over there eventually. I don't know how to get over there right now, though. Okay. We did not crush Spider Baby this time. And we'll do with this. Okay, okay. How do we get past here now? Oh, wait. We can kill that thing. We find another spider baby. How do we get past this? No, that does nothing. That does nothing. I wonder, can we do like this and keep this from falling down? And then does flipping this back do anything? Not what I'm meaning to do! I need skills for real. This game is much more difficult than it seems to be. Break all of you! This game should not be this difficult. Oh, well that's not great. In my honest opinion, this game should not be this difficult for something this cute. Okay, so no, my webs are not strong enough to keep it from falling down. One can only hope. Okay, so now I have a decent way I can climb up. So we're gonna need to do this. There we go. Flip that back. That gets two of them up. Now, how do we get the last one up? Because we can't keep these up. Unless maybe we can do something with web? What? I fell. <laughs> I need to learn to get good at games because I am hardcore struggling. <laughs> Okie dokie. So, if we connect this to there, so this way is open. We need it to go <clears throat> then from here left. Maybe this is a secret? Yes! We figured it out, boys. I am proud of myself. I did it good. No! My poor little spider baby! I am so sorry! How do I do this? Okay. We're gonna take it slow and try not to kill our beautiful little puzzle spider baby with puzzles. Okay, we made it. Next area. Come on me, learn how to platform. Hey, it's it's like zero IQ right now, my dude. Not gonna even not not even gonna try to lie. No, I trapped myself. I had to murder myself. I'm sad now. Okay. So, you need to go over here. And then we need to find a way to bring you back. This one, I'm fairly certain, is enough to pull that one back. So we're just gonna need to 
be set up here. Okay, we don't want to do that yet. Okay. So basically, we're gonna need to connect this to this one, then drag that one with us. Ooh, I missed. Okay, that actually works out. Let's do this. Come on, Pew. This is much more difficult than it seems. Let's just do this. This seems easier. No, I can just climb straight up. Let's go. Okay. We have the other gear. Which we just need to knock down here. And then another baby. No! I missed the spider baby. Sad now. Okay. So we're going to climb up here first. And then we're going to connect one from here down to the bottom completely. We're gonna break, not that one. Oh, oh well, it works out. And then we need to connect, mm, let's just not do that. We're, we need to connect the gear to the ceiling. And then preferably catch a ride with it if we can. There we go. And we're gonna slowly work our way up. Nope, that's not what I want to do. Let's just, like, slowly pull this up further. This is somewhat working. Am I doing it right? No! Well, we messed up. Attempt numero dos. You to here. I catch a ride. I pull you up away from the wall. That way, you don't get caught in the wrong place. This is very complicated. I hope I'm doing this right. We need to break the right things, but not the wrong things. Okay. I think we're getting somewhere. Nope, that's not what I want. So we need from you up. You up. You up. Okay. We're almost there, guys. <laughs> We're figuring it out. Then you need to go over there. And then we need to sneak our eyes under. Okay. There we go. You are now mostly free. Now, we are going to slowly drag you to your correct position, which is up here. That's not where I meant to put it. Up the daisy. That's still not where I meant to put it. Let's see if we can get a better angle. We just need to get this up top somehow. Let's break that. Okay, there we go. We have it free hanging now. Now we can slowly work our way up. Let's go. It's slowly going up. It's just gonna take me a hot minute. I don't think this is how you're supposed to play the game, but it's working, guys. It's working in its own diluted way. Can I push it up into place? Is there too many, are there too many spider webs there now? No! Okay. Starting over. Done. And up. Okay, that doesn't work. Two. No, that's not what we want. That's not the right one. Okay. We need you to get up top. while not getting yourself all twisted in a knot. Come on, my dude, just get up top. This is much more difficult than it seems to be. Because I also think I have to do this without getting too many webs in the way. Oh, that backtracked me. We're slowly getting somewhere. I'm not sure if it's to where we want to go, but we're getting somewhere. Come on. Yes! We did it! Now, I don't know what that did. Is the only thing.
If we get you on this, would we be able to like lift this out? I don't know. I'm so lost. <laughs> Let's break all those loose spider webs. Okay, where does this go? This goes over here. Then it goes over here. Okay, then it goes down here. Okay, we have a nice safe way to travel there now. We'll find a way to save that dude later. We're getting somewhere. Okay, that's a wall. That's not a, like, experience thing. Can we get... <sighs> Time to play with more webs and try to figure out what in the world we're doing wrong. AKA everything. Okay, now you. Come on, I believe in you. Yes, we're making progress. Now, yes, we can. Okay, so now how do we get something up there? I'm guessing we have to use this? Or does this go on here? So that unlocks that. What does this do? I don't know what that button does. We'll probably figure out here soon. <laughs> the mechanics in this game are godlike. They are so cool so far. I love them. I don't know what half these buttons do though. We did find another pipe though. No! It's pistons! My poor spider maybe is gonna get hurt some way. No. Don't hurt my spider boy! My poor spider baby! <laughs> How could they do this to him? He's so cute and innocent! Like, I love this game, but I also hate it at the same exact time because they're hurting my little spider baby. Okay, so we need to get pipe pieces in there. So you need to go over there. And then we just have to slowly lift you into place. But you're underwater now. So you need to go over there. I like that I can swim, swim at least. That does make life easier. Now we break this one. And now, we break it to this one, and we take you, and we lift you further up, ha-ha! Then, we take you, and we pull you further up, break these, drag you further up again, we're getting somewhere. This is extremely complicated, and I don't know how this works, but we're getting somewhere. Let's see if I can learn how to be a good spider. That's all I want in life, is to be a good little adorable dancy spider boy. Because I mean, look how cute he is! He does the dance! You cannot deny that this is the cutest spider in all of existence. And if anybody disagrees, I'm sorry, but they are wrong. And I will vehemently state that fact and believe it forever. see if we can get a better vantage point to go from. Looks like a good vantage point. Okay. No, nope, that's not what we wanted to break. Through. We just need to keep slowly raising it into position and then probably get a better vantage point from this side, hopefully. Yes, we can get a decent vantage point here. You to here. Now... We can start bringing him over. Now what we're going to do is we're going to carefully remove most of this gobbledygook. gook. Don't go too far down. I want one from you up to here. There we go. Now we keep doing that to raise you into place. We're getting there. Okay. Now we're going to go back to the other side. I like that it sounds like guitar strings. The music and sound in this game is fantastic so far. Now we're going to carefully pull you- Yes! <gasps> Progress! 
one of the pipelines has been restored. Why do I feel like I'm not going to want to know how many pipes I'm going to have to bring from really complicated places all the way over here? I feel like I'm going to cry once I figure out where I actually have to go in this game. Hey, we that's good enough. <laughs> Yo! Imagine! Hi, Imagine. How are you today? Hopefully you're having a pretty good one. We are playing as a adorable little Nancy Spider Boy. I am in love. He is my new child. He is the best boy. And uh, don't let Kita hear any of this. My dog might murder me if she hears any of this. Okay, now, we need to bring this pipe all the way over here. This is the part where I was like, I'm gonna cry when I have to see where how far I need to take this, aren't I? Yeah, this is that exact moment. Yeah. We're gonna break you. We're gonna break you. We're gonna break you. We're gonna grab you, and we're gonna pull you over here. Then we're gonna break you, and we're gonna break you, and you, and we're gonna climb up here if the pipe allows us. Thank you, pipe. I appreciate you working with us today. That's not what I wanted to no. know. Well, that's not what we wanted to do, guys. <laughs> Dude, you had power out for an hour? That sucks. I had a power outage here recently and I was like, no, thank you. The only power outages I like are when I'm at work. Although I do have to make up any time I miss due to like power outages and stuff, which is a bit of a bummer. But you know what? It gives me a break mid shift, which is always nice. Okay, now we break this one. And then we break carefully this one. And then we climb up. And we grab you we pull you further up and then we are going to switch this line oh, I broke the wrong line I'm not good at this this is very difficult this is way more complicated than I thought it was going to be I did not think this game was going to be like this I was very wrong though and now I have an accidental line where I don't want it now I need to carefully break this line. That's not the line I needed to break. I need to break that one. There we go. Now, you go over there. Thank you. That's not what I wanted to do, game. Please work with me. The physics are real in this one, boys and girls. The physics are real. And we swing. Now, we're going to pull you pretty far over here because we need to be pulling this guy basically sideways right now. And then we're going to get up to here so we can break that. We don't want to drop him too far down, so we're going to carefully bring him up a little bit more. Okay. And then we will bring him sideways again and into place. We have two. Now where's the last pipe? Well, I have a feeling it's going to be underwater. Oh, how did I guess it? I actually didn't see it before. <laughs> okay. So, now, we need to very carefully drag this guy out of the water, up the walls, and into that location. So, what is the best way to do this? We're gonna, first off, break everything here. No! I broke the wrong one again. I'm not great at aiming, guys, in case you haven't noticed from previous games I've played. Okay. We're gonna actually put in several strands here to just sort of get it over this way. And then drag it up a bit more. We're gonna break that line now. And we're gonna go up the left side where we have easy access. Ish. We used to have easy access. We no longer have access. Let me up! I'm gonna have to break so many lines now because of that. Okay, careful. Okay. You need to go up here. 
That means we have a couple of lines in bad places. There we go. Now we need to take you straight up for right now. This is literally my new all-time favorite game. This is literally the best thing I've ever played in my life, I think. <gasps> it's so cute. It is so cool so far. I'm literally in love. Let me get you to where I can pull you over. Okay, there we go. We're getting somewhere now. We just need to pull him, not there. That can go away. We need to pull him. Yes! The water pipes are reconnected. We have made progress. All right. Now, we need to figure out where to go from here. It is adorable, dude. No! We have to go up through the pistons. I'm already a nervous wreck. I don't want to lose my precious baby boy. He's so cute. He's the bestest spider baby. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so we have to very carefully plan webs so that we don't hit these trap mine things. Okay. We did that portion. Okay, I don't have to be scared here. This seems okay. <sighs> this game's not nerve wracking at all. You're not terrified of killing your baby boy. This is not the most terrifying thing I've done in way too long. Let me connect over here. No! <laughs> I deep fried my baby boy. Why do I always do this? I'm assuming that's oil. That's what it looks like to me. Everybody watching today is afraid of insects, apparently, and I just feel bad. But how can you be- Look at him! He's dancing! <laughs> He's literally the cutest creature to ever walk this earth! How could you- Why am I not walking on my spider web? I just want to walk on my spider web. Please, game. Stop making me kill my baby boy. Okay, I apparently reached a checkpoint there. Now we can just push this the rest of the way. That seems way easier. Ha! Hello! Oh, you fixed the drawbridge already! Outstanding work! Now that the rest of the colony can get through, we can start fixing this place up! It's so cute! I'm literally obsessed. Many thanks! Many thanks, comrade! The ants around these chambers are now comfortably hydrated. <laughs> I need to put an insect warning on this game. Because there's a lot of them. Let's see what's up here. I have a feeling there's gotta be something up here. I can just talk to random ants. That's like the best thing I've ever seen. Okay. So there's random ant holes literally everywhere. I can talk to everyone. Okay, so there's a way to the surface. Which is, nope, not the surface yet. I love this mechanic. This is literally one of the most unique game mechanics I have ever seen in my entire life and I'm already obsessed. Like, it sounds like piano or guitar wires. It's actually insanely fluid for what we're doing. I've, like, 
For something this unique, you wouldn't expect this high of a quality, but like the developers went above and beyond. This does not feel like an indie game. This feels like a straight up AAA game. So we found the living quarters now. That's vaguely terrifying. What is this? Engineering. We were waiting on a delivery from engineering, weren't we? I wonder if we need to get this over here. I have a feeling that's the middle leg. So let's try connecting you up here. I have a feeling this is right, even if I'm not sure. I just, I have a feeling. It's, it's suspicious, a suspicion, if you may, that this is what's right. It matches up. Yes! I was right! Okay, one leg attached. We have the water, we have a leg. We're making progress. I guess when you are as big and tall as I am, it's the little things that scare you. Oh, Don't be scared of buggers. They're adorable and sweet and cute and sweet and amazing. Okay, you attach to this. And I want you to attach to over here. And we're gonna attach from you down. This is nerve wracking. Okay. So we can. Okay, there's another leg. Is this like time? Why did it close right as I approached it? No! My baby! <laughs> I keep murdering him. I feel so bad. Y'all have no clue. <laughs> This hurts me inside. Okay, so that lifts that. Don't love it. Thank you for the well wishes. I appreciate you coming out. Okay, so we need to make very intricate bridges that don't touch these very large and very scary things that activate very large and more scary things. I don't like this. This is terrifying. This is actually terrifying. No, please no. I'm too young to die. My little spider baby boy is too adorable to die in such a horrific way. He does not deserve all of this stress. He is too pure. He is the most innocent of all creatures, and I love him. It is literally the cutest game I've ever played in my entire life, and I am obsessed. I need to go from here. Nope. Let's get the timing right. Because I'm faster on my webs than on the ground. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know what I'm doing. I think this is a leg piece. So I'm assuming we want to go up with this. Then you can get bound to one of these and I can hop on my little web. No! Wait for me! Climb the web! Okay. I'm coming with. I'm coming with! Really? That's how you're gonna be? Taking my leg without me? Just let me hop on something, please. Okay. So. Now. We need to get this somewhere. And I don't know where. Also, this thing is heavy. So it's gonna be a pain in my butt to move. At least the spiked feet don't kill us. Okay, we can go from here over to here. No, please. Be careful, giant ant leg. Why are the ants building a mech anyways? 
curious about that. Okay. So. Let's connect from here to here, here to here. Let's make a nice little web here that I can use to move around. Okay. So we want to shoot you. That puts you down there. We're going to connect over to here. That way I can come sort of see where you're going. No! I don't know where we want to get you. I think we just need to get you down here. Which means that I can do this, no issue. Do I need to get you further? No, I can just take you there. Oh, thank goodness. That would have been so annoying if I had had to do that differently. I almost got squished. Don't squish! Don't squish my baby boy! No! Oh, my poor baby boy! <laughs> my little spider baby is too cute for this! He's too pure! He doesn't deserve this! He's too precious! He doesn't deserve any of this! Why must he try to save his boo? <laughs> <sighs> this is traumatizing. Okay, so we need to get you down. I don't know how we get you down. I think we have to find your leg piece. Now, I believe there was probably... Yes, okay. So we need to get you back down here and probably put you on here. So you're going to go over here. Let's get you on top. Okay, perfect. And then let's take a ride up with it. Okay. I know there has to be another leg piece here somewhere. Because it only makes sense. I'm bad at games. Uh, what way do I need to go? Where is the stuff I seek? Where does this one come down again? I need to figure out how to get that one down. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to go back up here somewhere. Which I'm not super thrilled about. Because this was very difficult the first time. So I doubt it'll be much easier the second. Okay. So, when I flip the lever, that comes open, and... There has to be another leg piece here somewhere, then. Is it down here somewhere? We're going to do more exploration, because we're missing something. Okay, we haven't been down yet, I don't think. So, maybe the other leg piece is down here. That was close. Also, I like the textures here. The textures are very nice and make it relatively easy to find your little babies. Is there something over here? Yeah, that... <laughs> My poor little baby boy. <laughs> Why must you make me murder him brutally like this? There's the other leg piece. Okay. So... Can we break this if we attach enough strands to it? I'm not sure. I don't think so. Okay, so we need to get you over here. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the power of levers. <laughs> it worked. I can be a smarticle particle sometimes. And then we're going to very carefully drag you. No! No! My poor baby spider baby boy. <laughs> I feel so bad because I keep on accidentally Really? That was not the one I broke game. You know better than that. Okay. So we're going to attach a nice little guideline here. We're going to go down and destroy that row. Then we're going to bring you... Over here. Can we do anything with you? Do you move? No, you don't. Okay. Let's break the right one. This one can go now. Ooh. No! My baby boy. <laughs> I feel so guilty playing this game. Okay. 
you are now on the platform and secured. So we're gonna make something that goes from here to here just so I can get up. Now I think we just need to get this gear over to there, which honestly doesn't seem too terribly difficult. So let's grab you and we're gonna pull you up first. Pull you up further as we need to get you over this. This is more nerve wracking than I expected it to be by a lot. Now we need to pull you to the left a couple of times. Okay, now we can break both of these. Now we can break you. Now we are going to jump down and we are going to connect from you here. And then we're going to break these. We did it! We did it, ladies and gents! <laughs> We're making progress! <laughs> this is literally the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay. Now, I just think we need to get you over there. So, we're gonna fire. We're gonna shoot from here over. Let's hope it doesn't. That's exactly what I didn't want you to do, game! Now, I need an easy way up, please. Now you go up here. Let's break that one. Okay. It actually broke the one I told it to this time. It's a miracle, guys. <laughs> it doesn't like agreeing with me all the time. Okay, we're gonna hop to this one. Carefully shoot that one. Up the daisy you go. Now we're gonna break the one I'm on. Continue pulling you up and over. Break the one I'm on. And now we should be able to get you the rest of the way over here with just one or two strands. Ah, yes. Progress again. I think that's the entirety of this area. So now we're just going to go up and uh, continue on. Alrighty. The nerves are real. Where's my leg piece going to come up? Okay, it cam comes up there. That is not too terribly difficult to get to. We're just going to do it this. We're going to do a climb. And then we are going to connect you to the rest of your leg. Up you go. Takes some time. But we'll get him there eventually. Hopefully. Come on, little buddy. Yes! We have the leg. Okay. Now, you are going to come over here. And this leg is also going to come here. Then, we're going to carefully bind the two of you together with so many strands, I hopefully won't be able to somehow magically break you apart. Because I need to move both of you at the same time. Because I don't want to be making this trip multiple times. Upwards, please. So, we need to get both these bad boys over... Nope, that's not where I wanted to go. We want to get them onto this platform. So, we're going to make some handy-dandy guidelines. I don't want to do that. I want to go from here to about here. And then we are going to slowly and carefully maneuver these bad boys so that they're where we need them. They're very heavy. So this might take a little while. That's not where I wanted one. Let's move these one at a time. I think it's more worth it. Now I have to undo all that work I did connecting them. <laughs> we're going to connect you down to the bottom here. And then we're going to separate you two. Okay. Now they're separated. This ho guy hopefully shouldn't decide to go anywhere randomly while we're hauling up his brother. And upwards and onwards. We don't want that there. It can get swankily sometimes, but all around I like it so far. I don't fully understand the mechanics, but I think I see what we're going for. Now we're gonna hop into this mess. We're gonna cut the whole right side. Okay. Now, 
drag over. One or two more should be enough. Here we go. Now we're going to attach you to the base. Shoot the rest of the stuff. There we go. We have one or two legs down. We're going to make sure you're fully secure to the base because we don't want you going anywhere. And we're going to pull up your sibling here. At least I'm assuming the, these, uh, you know, ant legs are siblings or whatever they are. So, these aren't really, you know, legs that I've ever seen, but they they get the job done. They're for an ant mech. Last time I checked, ants don't make mechs, but we're in a video game. We can have fantasy and enjoy it. Carefully break the correct stuff and start dragging you left. If we have too many strands, it becomes very difficult to, to try to maneuver all this. So that's why we're trying to be somewhat careful as we move stuff. Okay, now that can get broken. Okay, let's go ahead and attach. Okay, we're actually going to go down to the bottom here. Let's see if we can get a good angle to attach this guy. Hopefully just to... No! That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, well. Uh, we're going to pull him straight up. This actually gives us a pretty good angle to work from, though, honestly. So I'm not mad. We're going to pull him left. Left again. Now we will break this guy. And I think we're ready to flip the lever. We got to be careful because it will try to give us trouble. Okay. I think we did it. I think we have it in an okay spot now. Onwards and upwards. And over. Now, both of you, I need to go somewhere very specific. So I will connect both of you over here, and then I will come and I will break anything else that is tethering you as best I can. That is why I placed the tether tethers carefully. We will break this tether. And where do we need to get them? I think we just need to get them to here. Hopefully. If we have to get them further, I will be upset because that is a lot of work. And while this is a very hardworking ant, I do not want to spend 17 hours today moving ant legs. I would much rather be saving my boot. He seems like a very lovely blue ant, and I like him alive. Okay! Words carefully. Let's go. Where will they be deposited? We need to figure out where our legs get deposited. Okay, there's one and there's two. Sweet. So now we just need to get them over here. Slowly but surely. I should be able to just sort of shove these with my face. <laughs> yes, the face shoving works. Oh, well, for the most part. There we go. Let's break these. You get pulled over a bit more. We'll break this. You get pulled to your sibling leg. Come on. You're gonna do what I want you to eventually. There. Now. I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Upwards and onwards. We have two more legs for our little ant boy. We're gonna take one leg at a time and place them on our giant ape mech. I honestly don't know how much of this game I want to play today because I have, like I said, had barely any sleep. So I'm going to be worn out very soon. But I am also completely in love with this game at this moment and don't want to stop playing. Mr. Ant, good day, comrade. Can you get the heck out of my way? Please, por favor, pretty please. Pretty pleased with the cherry on top. You're very much in the way. Let's try and get this above you. If you're gonna be such a butthead. There. Good riddance. Get rid of these. We're gonna connect this to the far leg because we wanna do the far leg first. I think we also need to get you plugged in here maybe? We'll deal with that later. One thing at a time, game. One thing at a time. 
we all know I'm very bad about multitasking because I just don't know how to do it. I'm fairly certain that's what we need to do with that though. So that's, I'm glad that we figured that out pretty early. Okay, now we slowly pull this upwards until it slots into the joint. Yes! <laughs> okay, now, I'm fairly certain that this needs to slot into here. Can we get it to do what I want? Because that makes sense for why it is where it is. Is that what it's supposed to do? I'm guessing not. Oh well, we're leaving it there for right now. Let's get the other leg slotted in and then we'll figure out what in the world we're supposed to do with that. Let's break it. this one. I swear, Mr. Pain in my butt, can you please stop? There we go. Now we can just sort of shove this past you, hopefully. Luckily, this one doesn't have to go as far. I don't know why that stuff's there. Okay. Keep going. Slowly but surely, we'll work our way into that joint that we need to be in. Come on! Yes! All the ant legs are connected. Okay. Yes, I know you say good day. I don't know what we're supposed to do with this water. Maybe nothing? It makes sense that it would have to go in there. But when I try to shove it in there, it doesn't really want to. Is that what I'm supposed to do, or am I just... Okay, we're just gonna leave that be for right now. And see if we can figure out what else we need to do now. Okay. So... This gives me some places I can go. What happens when we flip you? Okay, that just changes direction. Let's see where this takes us. <sighs> this game is more nerve-wracking than you'd think, but it's also super cutesy. Also, it's time to hit the caffeine again. So we've done the water. Though there are still some pipes that don't have water that you can see there. I don't know where this takes us. We're gonna try to find out. Okay, it takes us up there, but we can get there just by doing this. So we probably need to move something from up here down. I don't know what it is yet, but we'll find out. We have water. Can't get that way. Let's see if we can figure out where else we need to go still. There's a lot of stuff up here that we have not been to yet, so let's try exploring upwards and onwards. I forget if this little spider has a name. If it does, I apologize, developers. I'm just calling him my little adorable baby boy because I love him. Don't judge me. Okay. I don't see any way to go up here. I don't really see any way to go anywhere right now. Maybe we need to get, you know, more water in? Because there's definitely still a pipe that's not active over here. So maybe that'll change stuff? Because I definitely can't get through that door right now. Okay. Time to figure out what else we're missing. Let's go back over to the water side, because there's still obviously pipes here that don't have water. The pipes down there have water. We don't we haven't had gas yet, I don't think. So let's go check out gas. Yeah, I don't think we've been here. I would remember being here. Okay, so we need to get a pipe over there. That shouldn't be too terribly difficult now that we've done this a few times. Just slowly pull it up. 
slow and steady wins the race. I just need to get good angles on stuff so that I can hopefully get it where I need it. There we go. So that's in place. I don't know where that leads me, but we're gonna go down here. We're following the pipes to the right. Okay, so you need to get connected. Get down to where I have a decent angle. We're gonna need to create a decent angle, aren't we? Okay. We're just gonna do this angle. And then we're gonna break all those. Okay, one pipe at a time. Let's create an angle from here to here so that we can get a little nice angle above. There we go. This lets us get up here where it probably is gonna be a lot easier to uh, finagle. Okay, there's one pipe. Now let's do the other. I have a feeling the second one's going to be harder. That's why we're using the net webs that we've already built. As well as the pipe that's already connected. That's not the one I meant to break. That is. Okay. Now let's connect one over here. Grab as close to the beginning as we can. I'm trying to be relatively careful here with where I'm placing stuff because this is actually super complicated. And I'm not sure if I can unplug my original one or not, so I want to be careful not to do that if I accidentally can. I think this is just going to be one of those ones where we just have to sort of sit here and be very, very patient. Okie dokie. Come on! Okay, so... Are you connected? Yes! Okay, both are connected now. Continuing to the right. Let's see what's up here. There's our cables, so we're rather our pipes. Upwards and forwards. We're missing two gears. Let's see what's up here. That's not where I meant to go, but that's okay. Okay. So there's one of our gears. Well, that one should be easy enough to get to where we need it to go. Just sort of drag and drop. And continue onwards until we get it to where it needs to go. That's not what I meant to do. Slowly upwards until it's where it needs to go. It's a lot faster if you drag it these long distances, I've noticed. So that's why I'm doing that. We're also going to create a nice upwards path here so that we can get above this. Because now I can destroy those. And give it nice, not there. Nope, that's not where I meant to go. Okay, one there, one there. Now we're gonna destroy you. Upwards further, destroy you. Upwards further, and we're in place. Beautiful. Where's our other gear? Okay, so that does something. I'm not actually 100% sure, but it does something. So now, we still have the two gears here. So we need to get the gear in there, and then it'll start turning this, which will turn that. Okay. So let's go back down. Come on, little spider bro. You can flip the lever. I believe in you. Yeah, that works. Okay. Where are... Okay, there's one more gear in there. Let's go ahead and make a safe passage. Okay, so there's both the gears. Really? Really, game? Why are you making me murder my spider boy like this? I love him. I don't want him to die. Why do you think I do? 
Okay. Well, we have multiple gears to pull, relatively long distances, so we're going to do just that. Preferably one at a time, because that does make it easier. And we're just going to sort of soccer kick this bad boy until it's in place. Oh, we can blast them into place. That's very nice. I didn't know that. Well, now you're attached. So now, not you. Oh, well. You... Really? You're being like this game? I want my gear. It's making all of these strands where I don't want them and none where I do. Okay. Upwards! Okay, that's why. It made another strand where I didn't want it. Really, game? Why are you like this? Why do you have to be so mean to me? Because now I have to make death-defying jumps and then make, you know, super creepy, scary webs to try and survive. Okay. There we go. You guys are now both attached. So now, the two of us or the three of us, rather, are going up. Finally. Progress! <laughs> of course, you had to go and get stuck underneath the lever. Of course you did. You're my least favorite gear, you know. You're my least favorite. I like your brother significantly better. He behaves. Unlike you, you troubled child. So we're going to put this first one in the close one because I feel like it. That's not what I meant to do. Onwards and upwards. That's not what I meant to do either. Oh well. Not too far. And down we go. We just need to take you over a little bit and you're in place. Beautiful. Now we need to get our problem child over here. You're really making me send the whole thing down without you. You know, you're a massive pain in my butt here. This child will never live this down. He will be in timeout for the next millennia until we get this mecha spider ant thing done. <sighs> I swear he lives to give me trouble. I don't know why I'm anthropomorphizing a deer, of all things, but I am. That's, that's the kind of mood I'm in tonight, guys. <laughs> you do have to admit, it is, it is an adorable game, though, so you want to anthropomorphize absolutely everything because you can't say no to this adorable face. You also can't say no to my skills. Actually, you can, because there are none. <laughs> okay, Mr. McGear, we're making progress. Not much, but some. So let's uh, shoot ya over here. And then we're going to slowly work your way upwards to your final home. Onwards and upwards. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, that actually surprisingly worked. Beautiful. So, that is putting oil into this. Which then is sending oil back the way we came. So let's go back the way we came now. I think we did everything over here. Uh, we did more puzzles. And we uh, got really angry at a gear. Yeah, the gear was annoying. <laughs> and I think we are delivering oil over to our giant ant mech thing now. Yes. Oh, come on. Why you undo yourself, top one? So we're gonna have to go fix this top one now because it decided to be a pain in my butt. Hopefully it doesn't kill us while trying to fix it. Really? I am going to murder this.
connect, you stupid pipe. Okay, there's one. Now let's do the other. I really don't have a good angle on this pipe anymore. That's not what I want to do. Okay. We're going to start over on this one. Please break that last little piece of spider wood that's annoying me. There we go. I think it's... No, it's not breaking yet. We're just peeling hot oil all over the place. You know, the stuff that kills us when we step in it. to very, very slowly and very carefully maneuver this to where it's where till it's where we want it to be. Because this one likes being a massive, gigantic, super annoying pain in our butt. As you can see by the fact I'm trying to connect to the top and it's giving me the bottom. And it's not destroying what I want it to. Can you just not connect to anything? Please. Okay. I'm half tempted to trap myself in here. Okay. That's not what I wanted to do. Okay. So let's go ahead and do this. We're going to give it some bracing. We're also going to come up here and we're going to fortify the top. When did I start working for BP? Uh, never. I'm working for ant, uh, ant oil, uh, industries. <laughs> okay, so you need to go up. And up some more. We need to get in there again. We need to get this bad boy up further. And then squeeze our way out. Come on. Come on, game. Let me out. Great. Let me out! Okay. Come on. Let me out. I believe in you, game. Let me out. Yes! It worked! <laughs> My insane strategy worked! Oh! We got a little ant baby from somewhere. Also, our propellant pipes are now connected. Hell yeah. I don't like that it now makes me go through this. This seems like hell on earth. Because I am not good at this. <laughs> I'm too young to die. such a precious child. He's so cute. He doesn't deserve this game. Why must you make me do this? It's such a jumbled mess there by now. It's almost as bad as, you know, my jumbled mess that I used to reconnect the power pipes. is such a cute little creature but I don't really have a choice the game forces me to let me out oh I survived okay not where I want to go I want to go to this far wall please okay no! Is there any way past that? I have to go up the left side, I guess. Okay. This is so annoying. D757 Gaming, welcome to the stream. Glad to have you here. We are trying to figure this out. Not really doing great. Okay, I don't think we can go up that way. That looks like a way you can only go down. <laughs> We're gonna try the left side now. It does not look much better. But hopefully we will survive. Oh, 
Oh, we survived. We survived, ladies and gents. Okay. We have fuel. We have water. Pump power station. I think we've done that. Water pump. Okay. Have we done the pump power station? Yes, we have. Because everything's spinning. Okay. We're gonna go up. Ah! This is so nerve-wracking. I think that's everything we needed to do. I don't know how to look at, like, a quest book or anything. Because, you know, me, I don't read tutorials. Okay. I think, really, by this point... Okay, maybe that opened up something new over here because it did. We didn't have fluid pipes over here. Okay, let's see if anything's changed over here now that we have fuel coming over here. Maybe it opened that door we couldn't get through before. No, that door is still closed. I love when he goes in water. It's so cute. Let's see if anything changed up top. Maybe we couldn't really do anything up top for it either. Oh gosh, it's all on fire! Can we move water somehow? I don't know how this works. <laughs> There's got to be some way for us to move fire, water and put that fire out is my next guess. Um, let's go. What is this? This is the forge? Have we been in here? I'm losing track of where we've been. Oh, all of the oil is on fire now. And this pipe is broken. I'm guessing we probably need to reconnect that. Slowly but surely wins the race. This is very difficult. Sega Man, welcome to the stream. Glad to have you here as well. Yeah, this doesn't really look safe to me either, not gonna lie. I don't see a way to be able to do this, so we're just going to run across the fire. Because that's totally safe. Oh wait, we haven't been down here. This would have been far safer to do, you know, when everything wasn't on fire, me. Give me the little baby. We have the little larvae. I'm happy now. <laughs> yeah, this is not the safest maneuver. Guys, please do not try this at home. This is for spiders only, not for humans. I, I highly recommend against this for any and all humans. Um, do not play with fire unless you are qualified to do so. Good day, comrade. The oven's all heated up for us. Can you lend us a web to send these mandibles through the forge? Uh, sure. I guess we haven't been here yet. Okay, so where is the oven? Also, I see the gear over there. Where do we need to go? Okay, so one gear just needs to go there. So that's going to be an easy decision for me, on my behalf of which one I'm sending where. Ah, come on. Let's do it this. <sighs> Good day, comrade. Yes, they are all comrades, and I love it. It is adorable, and they are the cutest things I have ever interacted with in my entire existence. You're looking for good day, mate? I mean, it makes sense since they're down under. <laughs> Underground, that is, of course. Only makes sense. I just need you to go up a little further, please. There we go, one in place. And clean up all the webs, make it nice and neat. I'm assuming the other one probably goes somewhere over here. Lots of fire! Let's see. I don't know what half these levers do. No, it has to come all the way over here. So, you are going to get destroyed. And then you, no, bad. It's not what I want to do. Let's jump on top of the mandibles. And we're going to drag you all the way over here. Nice. That's what we wanted. And slowly work our way upwards towards our left side gearbox to shove him in there. We did catch this strand, so this will be getting cut now. As well as whatever weird strand is there. There we go. And keep pulling him upwards. And then we're going to start pulling him left. This should be the easy part. Because now, we can cut pretty much all of those. 
can just slowly raise him and swing him, which will be nice. It's a much easier task than you. Okay, now I'm assuming maybe we just pull you down? Okay, so that starts that one. Yo, Sega Man, thank you for the follow, my dude. I appreciate that. Glad to have you out here joining us for streams, hopefully in the future as well, if you continue to uh, enjoy the content. Let's see. Okay. So, I think what we have to do is we need to get the mandibles on this one. So, yeah. That'll be easier done if it's lowered. So now, we need to lift these heavy boys up there. This will take a little while. Also, we attached in the wrong place, which is annoying. <laughs> Wait, what's so clever? Are you talking about the game or me? Because I'm hoping you're talking about the game, because otherwise you're sorely mistaken. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. This is a very chaotic, cha chaotic brain. Please. It is only, what time even is it? Brain, it is only 3.40 a.m. It is too early for you to be acting like this. Keep in mind, my normal bedtime is much later. <laughs> you know what? We could just connect you to here now that we have plenty of space. So we're going to connect you here and just use this to lift him up. So you attach here. There we go. And then we'll attach the front to the front. And then we'll attach a bunch of cables for you lift you up. Ha ha! I think we figured out how we're supposed to do this. <laughs> okay, so I think we need to switch you back. Now, we need to bring you over to here. Now we need to get rid of the wires that are not the ones that we want. which is a lot of them, very carefully. There we go. Now we switch you back on, and let's turn you off again. We need to be careful not to uh, mess this up. We're probably gonna get it into a good position. There we go. And we're going to be careful not to jump into the fire. We're going to attach it to the next one that comes through. Not to that. Okay. Let me turn you off! Oh, I think we're going to have to redo that because it's probably out of position by now. It is, of course. Okay, so we're going to switch you on. Wait for it to get into position. Turn it off when it does. Hook it up. <laughs> And then go from there. Turn off. Okay. Please have worked this time. Ha! We're doing what we want now. Comrade Dance will be very proud of us for our efforts. Okay. Now we're going to very carefully just lift this up and attach it very carefully to this platform so that they get lifted nice and neatly into the fire. Okay, that should be good. And let's turn you back on. See, we're getting better. We're learning how it works. Now we're gonna follow this path across because this probably leads to the other side of the furnace. Oh, lovely. Fire! This is terrifying. I am a Ant, we don't like fire. Okay. So yes, I knew there had to be some reason we came up here. This is why. I'm guessing maybe the mandibles come out from up here? That makes sense if they come out from up here. So let's go check that. Okay, yes. So they come out of here blazing hot. So what we have to do now is we need to get these blazing hot mandibles down. And then there's that pool of water, which I have a feeling we need to go douse these in. 
because you can't exactly put something this hot onto a metal structure. Not safe, but hot stuff. Uh, did you mean hot stuff? <laughs> okay, keep on pulling it. I want to be careful not to get caught when it drops. Okay, there we go. That's where I wanted you. Now, we're, instead of lifting it this way, we're just going to drag it to the left and then slowly work our way across. So now we're going to attach it to the ceiling here so that it won't drop. And then I'm going to follow these and I'm going to go cut all these. See? Aha! Progress. Now we don't have to mess with this whole shebang. And we're going to need to lift this up a little bit because otherwise I will get hit when I try to walk underneath it. I should be able to go underneath it now. So we're going to connect from here to here. We will carefully climb underneath it. Okay, we didn't get burned. We're good. And now we're going to pull it to the left. Not on the lever. I swear, game, sometimes you don't agree with me. It's such a shame because I have such good ideas for you. Okay, now we're going to very carefully continue lifting up and over. That's not where I want to connect. I swear, game, can you please stop with the bullshittery? Eh, close enough. There we go. Upwards. I want you sort of to be up, please. And now we're going to carefully swing this. I have a feeling if we step on that, it will burn us, so we're going to jump over it. And continue to drag. I have a feeling all we need to do by this point is just get it to this water pool. We're going to jump up some of these strands, go to the ones that are holding it backwards now, and get rid of those. And continue to pull forward. There are so many spider webs here. Okay. All of these are going now. And continue to pull. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Hopefully that doesn't mess anything up. Okay, it doesn't look like it's going to. Into the water! You can do it! I believe in you! If I break these two, I should be in the water. Not quite yet. Okay, come on. Okay, now that is in the way, so we need to go break that. And we're doused! <laughs> now we need to attack them to the mech ant. Yes, it has a lot of eye lasers. It is adorable, is it not? Is this not the cutest little spider you have ever seen in your entire life? Okay, so now we need to take this all the way back. Because, <laughs> you know, taking it one way is never enough. We always have to take it both ways. So we're going to lift her upwards, rotating her around. So now we're going to break that bad boy. So I actually feel like rotating it's probably going to be the easier method to get nice large pools out of this. Not there. Come on, game. Go where you're directing. Ha! It's working. My strategy is somewhat working. I think. I can't actually tell if my strategy's working or not because I don't know how this game works. But we're getting somewhere and we're getting something done. Yes! I know! Yes! Yes, yes! Yes! The little dancing Spider-Man! <laughs> I'm obsessed! <laughs> wait, 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 You can make people dance with you? Um, why was no why did nobody have, uh, inform me of this? Excuse me. Uh, that is, uh, why, why was I not informed of this? This is, uh, vital information. I, I should have been informed of this immediately. I'm very upset I have not been informed of this before now. I need to go find an ant immediately. Yes! Okay, they have the mandibles. We need to go find an ant right now. You! him so much okay so i'm guessing now we just need to attach this mandible 
to one of these to get carried. Nope, not like that. Let's attach it so that I can write it, please. Thank you. There we go. Now we're gonna write this down because this is much easier. You love how Moth is dancing? I haven't seen him dance yet. I need to find him and dance with him now. Ah, this game is so cute. <laughs> I'm so obsessed with this game already. Wait, does it just automatically attach if we keep on writing him like this? We're gonna have to attach those to the ant, aren't we? Yeah, I can see the little fueling ports. Okay. Well, now we know how to get there to uh, attach those later. That'll make life easier. It's getting a bit caught, but that's okay. Let me out. Let me get to my ant baby. Thanks for helping with the assembly. I'm still going through the checklist in here. Okay. So, we got her wedged. Like, really stuck. Like, this is not going to be good levels of stuck. So we're going to hope that we can catch this passing thing here. And hopefully it'll be enough to unstick this. Okay. We have it unstuck. Okay. Now we just need to raise it out of here. So using those was not the best idea. It, it did get us nearly deaded. <laughs> ah, that could have been bad. Come on, raise it. No! You're foiling all of my plans, you piece of wood. <laughs> those darn robots. Is it the uh, chatbot, I'm assuming? Because I don't really have anything set up. I've only been streaming like two weeks. So apologies if it's not really well set up right now. <laughs> I'm learning as I go. So hopefully at some point soon we'll have some better looking stuff going on here. And hopefully once we hit affiliate we'll actually be able to, you know, get the lovely emotes and all. Okay. No! Give me... Excuse me! It just stole my thing! I cannot believe it straight up stole my mandibles! I know, I can go flip the lover, but I don't really feel like it right now. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I'm lazy as shit. Okay. Well, we're gonna start pulling you over to here, because I think we just need to plug you up to the top. That makes a lot more sense than what I was trying to do before. A little further. Ha! Ah, there we go. You're filling with water now. We'll wait for it to bring my mandibles back, and then we'll retrieve them. <laughs> Strong wood robbery. Because last time I checked, these wood pieces do not have any arms. But yeah. D757, where did you come from, my dude? I've not, definitely not seen you before. And Stegaman, if you're still here, are you from Twitter, YouTube? Where are you from? I went to the original place. It should be coming right back. You saw me on Twitter. Nice. Twitter is paying off. I don't know how to socialize. <laughs> so. It should come back, right? Th these things these things go in a loop, right? It it'll bring it back, right? <laughs> it'll bring it back, right? <laughs> Tribulation tagged you me. Cool. Okay, I don't actually know who that is. I will have to, if you can, link them to me. Uh, send me a message on Twitch. I think I have that enabled. Oh, it dropped it here. That makes a lot more sense. We can just do this. There we go. Now you need to come over here. Yeah, I I don't know a lot of people on Twitch yet, so if I don't know somebody, uh, I would appreciate if you guys can just link them to me so I can start learning who more people are. Because I need more friends in the streaming slash everything community. <laughs> yes! Mandibles attached! Now I just need to do this other uh, pipe, which I'm assuming is the fuel pipe, and then I think we'll be good. I think that's still connected properly. I can't tell. <laughs> It's not really easy to tell most of the time on this bot for some reason. Imagine knowing people- Aiden! 
You know literally everybody. Everybody in YCC loves you, dude. You can, uh, no falling out of here with that. No, I don't know anybody's stuff. You know better than that. That's not good. Come on. Just go connect for me. We're gonna fight, aren't we? I'm gonna have a fight with this robot at this point. Really? You're gonna be like this robot. <laughs> uh, you'll have to send it to me in DMs. I do have links turned off in chat. You're talking IRL? Oh, I don't know anybody IRL either, dude. People IRL are difficult. IRL people are weird. Having real friends that aren't on the internet is overrated. Hey! <laughs> Looking good, Tom, right? Get over here and let's have a talk. I don't remember what voice I gave to you originally because it's been like two hours. <laughs> I'm falling. Uh, let's go talk to this dude. But first, oh, not that. Dance party! <laughs> That's so cute! <laughs> Appreciate it. Hold up a second, comrade. The platoon is moving out. Look at him. Oh, my baby. Ah, I did it good. Mankind equals mandible claw. My Only my wrestling fans will get it. Hey, wrestling fans. I almost dated a pro wrestler once. Wow, what a beautiful display. Comrade Spider, we're making you an honorary member of the engineering corps for your service today. And I've sent your workforce ahead to help you out with your mission on the surface. They'll have that balloon up and flying before you know it. Dismissed. Okay, how do I get out of here? I don't know how to leave. I think it's this way. Let's hope I can find my way out of this place now. Because honestly, I have no idea where I came from. And I have no idea where I'm going. So this will be an interesting one. As I try to figure out where the heck I am trying to leave from. I'm assuming it's up this way. I'm assuming I just need to keep heading up. I also know nothing about wrestling, which is why if I had dated a pro wrestler, it would have been a very bad decision. <laughs> oh, do you know Aiden? Aiden's legit. Aiden's awesome. Okay, how do I get out of here? Can I teleport? Please? Oh, this is telling me, like, where all the secret stuff is. Okay. I found seven things. Oh gosh! <gasps> oh my god! There are outfits! This is the happiest day of my life! I can have my little guy in an engineering outfit! I love it so much! I, my life was not complete before now. I know that now. I don't know how to get out of here. I forget. I, I know I came through tubes to get here, but I forget where the tube. No! I killed my baby. I feel so guilty right now. If anybody knows how to get out of here, I'd appreciate help. <laughs> I don't know where all the fast travel points I saw earlier were. <laughs> Click my heels three times. I don't think that'll work, my dude. Wait, why is there water rising? What the heck? No! <laughs> Is there gonna be water rising here now? I'm so confused right now. I'm guessing we just filled that area with water somehow? Uh, okay, so... <clears throat> That's not where I wanted to go. Okay. Go back to the robot room and go 
Straight up and to the right. Okie dokie. Artichoke. Sounds good to me. Let me climb it in time. Yes, we made it. Okay. Robot room was not this way. <laughs> I'm horrible with directions, guys. Please never let me drive a vehicle without my phone, which I use as a GPS. <laughs> okay. Robot room. Straight up and to the right. Oh, this looks right. Yeah, I'm blind. Also, I need new glasses, apparently. <laughs> uh, I'm struggling hardcore. <laughs> the exit! Yes! Uh, wait, there's a map? Oh, there is a map. I was literally just looking at the map, but it's not really easy to read. So, I don't know how to navigate. Is this the right way? Am I going the right way? Do I need it? I think I need to go through here. I am hope I'm going the right way. <laughs> Otherwise, we're just going to have, you know, a whole episode of me trying to figure out where the heck I'm supposed to go. Which, I wouldn't be surprised if that happens someday. It's pretty much just me anytime I play anything. Do I keep going up here? Or am I going the wrong way? I think I'm going the right way. Can I explode that? No, I can't. Okay. Oh! I think I found it. Hey, you, soldier dude. I love this so much. This is literally the cutest thing I've ever done in my life. I don't think anything can ever top this cute value. It's so cute. Okay. So we found the ants. Make the gray spider dance. Okay. You! <laughs> They're mimicking each other. I love it so much. Oh gosh, have you seen any little spiders around here? My babies got startled when that big bird flew by and they've scattered all over the bush. Please, if you find any, bring them back to me. They're too young to be off on their own. Forty babies. You expect me to find forty little babies? My babies are out there. Please help me find them. I'm assuming that's what I've been picking up, or just the wolf spider babies. I'm not sure, though, because that doesn't really make sense. <laughs> interesting can we catch a ride up on that that would be much easier than trying to you know walk oh it's a little really so the whole thing i've been missing this entire time is i'm trying to figure out how to climb the rope it's left click and I've just been sitting here using right click the entire time. I really need to learn how to read commands, guys. This is a serious issue by this point. <laughs> Companion! Hey, fellow engineer! I'm Vlad, your airship mechanic. We're almost ready for the trip of a lifetime. Here, take these blueprints. We've got lots to do. Okay, so we need fuel, an engine, patches, a moth's nest, the spider webs, and the pilot platform. We have half of it. Here's the rest of our pre-flight flight checklist. Find a way to patch up the balloon. I heard the bees to the east might be able to help with that. Find a fuel source. Some good concentrated dung would work. See if you can find some to the west. Attach engine immediately below the mouth of the balloon. Firmly secure pilot platform to the balloon. Oh, and if you run into any trouble, just shoot the work bell and we'll reset everything for you. Okay, that's cool. So we need to attach you to this. Okay, so it's right click to it. Really? Okay, I just have to do this. <sighs> it has such a satisfying ding. Oh, really? Really? This is how you want to reset and save me. <laughs> I'm trapped. Okay, let's sing that again, but not when I'm underneath it. I think I just fell really far. No, not too far. Okay, I saw Mr. Mothman, though. Ding! I now understand how so much more of this game works. Now that I understand how to move. You have no idea. 
how much better this makes everything now that I know how to swing like I saw like five minutes of gameplay of this game and then I saw that and I was like I want to do that that's cool I just now figured out I've been playing this game since 2 p.m. at two hours and I just now figured that out also <gasps> with everything now you are truly man spider <laughs> hi buddy these ants showed up just ahead of you made quick work of the tree they've been badgering me with these designs for ages but i've not had the courage to let them try it i'm glad you're helping each other though their plans seem solid even if they're too bold for me all right aiden I will not be burning anyone or anything. You can stop that, young man. Ooh, new place to go. Or is this where I came from? Oh, this is where I came from. I wonder if there's stuff up top. I feel like there's a secret here somewhere. There has to be, right? Oh, no, we're just redoing the entire tutorial. I love that. This is so much better now that I know how to actually somewhat operate, though. Not gonna even lie. So much better. <laughs> okay. Oh, there was a fly there. That hurt. So how do I get up there to him? There has to be somewhere I can connect. I love him sliding. It's so cute. Behold, Predator, I am the Fly Lord. Your fangs are too small to devour me. My kin don't sit well in your if my kin don't sit well in your stomach, come pay me a visit. We'll see what we can do about that. Oh, cool. I don't know what the whole purpose of that is, but it's something. I love this. This is delightful. So that's the tutorial. I'm assuming there's something over here then, because we can go this way. Is this the is this the dung beetles? Did I find them? I'm so speedy and cute. Oh my god, speed mode! Speedy Gonzales! I love him. Wait, can I trap the flies and eat them? curious now. I think I've- I think you can. Like, it makes sense, right? Oh, <gasps> You can eat flies! I will feed this man with all of the flies he could ever dream of. He will be fat and happy. There must be some way to do some stuff here. Okay, there we go. So we want to be careful. Can we touch this? No, we can't. Okay. Let's see if I can find anything to attach to over here. Not yet. Maybe something at the top. I'm struggling to find a place. Okay, so we're going to go catch some flies. Because I'm assuming we can make some pretty cool traps. Or, you know, at least hopefully catch some more flies. Because my, my poor little baby boy here needs to eat more flies. He's looking a bit small. There has to be something else here, right? Ah, got another. Love how speedy it can be. Ah, this is so satisfying! 
This is literally my favorite game of all time and will always be. No, I fell out. Okay. Well, we're gonna go explore to the right side now, maybe? We're gonna break that up a bit more. Oh, this is so much nicer! You have no idea. This is literally just 17 times better now that I actually know how to use the game mechanics. It's a spider ring! It's so cute! So we're gonna do... Are they gonna do a workshop for this game? If they do, that would be completely epic. It's another spiderling! Okie dokie. We're getting somewhere. We're learning. We're growing and developing skill sets we never knew we had. Ah, oh, this is delightful. Another spiderling! I must save you for your mother! I have three of them now. There's gonna be a bunch hiding that I'm never gonna find, but I love that they included that in the game. Just like little mini side quests that you can do. Like, that is so smart to have done. Because everybody loves them some side quests. <laughs> Especially me, because I am obsessed with everything. Everything about this game is amazing. Hi, little spider, I've got a quest for you. The queen is making a new princess to make a brand new hive. To make a princess, she needs royal jelly, and to make the jelly, she needs pollen. Only the best pollen, pink orchid pollen. 20 grains should do it. And now this pipsqueak, pipsqueak right in your back. Bee boys. If you bring that up to Canopy's Peak, I bet she'd love you. Come on. That sounds good. We will be the bestest pollen collector of all time. I don't understand this. I don't know why the bee cannot collect the pollen himself. But that's Canopy's peak there. Now I wonder. Yes, the orchids do grow in here. It makes absolutely no sense that there's orchids, which are very hard to grow, growing inside of a tree. But you do you, game. I approve regardless. You made it something too cute for me to complain about pretty much anything. Another orchid. I don't like the whole, you know, I can die part of it, but that's okay. I revive. That's the important part. There's a lot of spikes here, game. Ow. I do not- Oh! I love this. It, uh, it lets me keep my pollen when I die. I don't have to re-grab any pollen that I already grabbed if I die. That is so nice. No! My boy, boy. <sighs> I hate hurting my baby boy. It makes me so sad. Big sad. No! I died. Bye, Aiden. Have a good day at school. Thanks for stopping by before school. Hopefully you have a good day at school. And a productive day. Productivity is important sometimes, unless you're me and you will do nothing besides play video games and eat food and do your, you know, job. Have a good day there. Are you on the quest for pollen too? I hope we get enough. I can't wait to meet the new princess. Sure is tiring flying all over this forest though. You go on ahead without me. I'll catch up. Not until we dance. <gasps> he just... <laughs> just wiggles yo cool animations what's up my dude how are you doing today hopefully you're having a pretty good one i am collecting pollen for the bee queen because apparently her own worker bees aren't good enough and i found a baby good little baby boy he's so cute ah this is the cutest thing in all time i am literally obsessed right now <laughs> Another little baby. I don't want you. I want the baby. Please. Just give me the child. Thank you. Let's see how they dance when they're not on the ground. <gasps> they shake their butts! <laughs> this whole game is just gonna be me discovering how different things dance 
Which, it makes sense, because bees, you know, bees actually communicate by dancing, by shaking their butts. So, like, that's actually sort of correct, and I love it, and I appreciate it. There's another fly for me to eat. No! Well, I need the babies. Babies are important. We also need more pollen. There we go. How many are in my eye? I'm at 11. We're making good progress. We need 20 by the time. No! <laughs> my poor baby died. Nope. Get back here. I want to eat you. Where did you go? I lost. Oh. Onwards and upwards. I'm guessing we have to go inside for this. Makes sense. We've already been in here, though. Okay. Woke up two hours before school to watch the best streamer make you laugh. Oh, thanks, dude. I am not the best streamer, though. I am a potato. I don't even have my stream fully set up. No, my poor baby boy. I keep murdering him. This is, this is distressing. How many times I have murdered this adorable creature. Also, there's another baby down there. And more pollen. I'm here, little baby. At least I keep the baby in the pollen. That's the important part. Alrighty. Can I figure out where I'm supposed to go, please? Not to my death. That is not where I'm supposed to go. I, is there a map somewhere that I'm just completely missing? There probably is. If so, I'm sorry, guys. I'm not good at this. <laughs> I'm here. Tasty. No! <laughs> no! I actually was doing good that time. Ah. This is mildly infuriating, extremely satisfying, and way too cute to be described. Really? I'm gonna fail this jump like 17 times. This is why I normally don't play platformers. I'm really bad at video games. Like, it, unbelievably bad. <laughs> the food chain, yes. Watch as this adorable spider that dances, eats the other equally cute and slightly less adorably and important little tiny baby bugs. Okay, where do I go from here? I think I needed to go up there. I'm sad. Now. Okay. Well, we're gonna go explore other locations, see if we can find another way to go, because I don't know where I'm going. I feel like it's telling me to go this way. Yeah, there's a beehive pointing this way. So I think I was just going to the wrong direction. We're gonna take a dance break. Shake the booty. <laughs> it's so cute. Okay, there has to be more over here. What does this sign say? Let's go find that out. I need to remember I can still use my old mechanics. But I can just do this. Company's peak 4200 centimeters. Another baby! No! I found the baby though. I must go save him. I have found him. Now I must save him for his mother. So that she will love me forever. And I will have myself another spider love since my current one is missing. Hopefully only missing and not dead. We don't actually know the state of our lover. Sort of a depressing thing. This is very difficult. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> there are lots of things that we could be eating, though. Careful. Slow and steady wins the race. Okay, here's some stuff we can climb on. There's another little baby ant, and there's a path to go. More pollen! And more stuff to break, because breaking stuff is fun. Upwards! Okay, to the right again. How far are we now? 3,500 centimeters. Tasty. Ooh, there's another orchid. Ew. 
I can and will make it to my goal. There we go. Anything over here? No. Just a dead end. Another baby! I must sa save all of the babies! They're so adorable! I never thought little baby ants could be so dang cute! No! Upwards! Okay, I know there was a baby here. Yes! Save the little infant. There's another ant uh, bee to talk to here. What do you have to say? Hmm! You've seen all these fruit flies buzzing about? Pretty annoying. I bet someone like you could catch them in your webs and eat them. Just saying. What a complaint. Yeah, I know I can catch them and eat them. Oh, little baby caught one for me. Aw, he's so considerate. I'm probably missing so much pollen, but I only need 20 and I'm already at 17. No! I died. Another baby to save. Adorable. Ooh, another orchid. We are now at 18 of 20 pollen. I wonder what happens if we get more than what's required. Oh wait, we can take the leaves. I forgot that. How do I take them? Yes, left click. I love it! There's a baby over there though. Must rescue all infants. I love this glider system. So dang cute. Okay. No, I failed. I think I want to go up and over. Nope, that was not the best move. Okay, grab you. Oops, today. Oops, I failed. <laughs> babies protect them at all costs. I have to find all 40, but I don't think I'd ever be able to because that's so difficult. That's just so many spider babies. So we're not going to try the left route anymore. We're just going to try and go, as I'm assuming, the correct way. <laughs> this is so much more difficult than it needs to be, or rather should be. I'm, I'm just very bad at games. I realize that more and more every single day. <laughs> I'm also making it more difficult by being impatient and trying to go faster. Oh, come on. That was just me being dumb. Just ignore my stupidity whenever I do stupid stuff, guys. It'll it, it'll work better in the long run for both of us if you do so. <laughs> Ooh, that could have been bad. It's not even difficult. It's literally just avoiding the giant ass spikes. And don't let go of my leaves, which I keep forgetting apparently as well. Okay, downwards we go. Really? Imagine if this game was before he goes to Tachi Uchika from being overworked. I'm very confused. I'm assuming we're talking about a Naruto reference? It's been way too long since I've seen this game. I'm uh, that show, I'm very sorry. If I'm missing a reference that I should be knowing because I am a weeb. It sounds like an, a Naruto reference though. Yes, Naruto, okay. Thank you. Heavens, I would have been very ashamed if I lost my weave status by such a Such such a margin. No! Okay, I got it post humorously and it gave me the checkpoint. Okay We just need <sighs> Worth it another bug for our belly We will be fat and happy by the time we are done. I just need one more pollen. Also, there's a baby here. I need to go save the baby before all else. Yo, Pembroke plays. Thanks for the follow, my dude. Welcome. We are playing the cutest game that I have ever seen. Also known as Webbed. I am obsessed. We need one final pollen for this B quest. That is the second quest that we are on. We have already finished the uh, ant quest, which is why I'm dressed up like a little worker ant. And there's my final pollen. 
Now we just need to finish getting the rest of the way to the uh, queen's room. The queen's nest, rather. Get back here, little fucker. Get back here. Ah! Lenimation, thank you for the follow, dude. I appreciate it. I will catch you. There we go. I caught him. Delicious. <laughs> oh, that looks deadly. Can I find a less deadly root, please? Can we collect extra pollen? We can. Ooh, no, no! <laughs> Where am I supposed to go? Not there. There is not a good place. Not up. We're gonna drop down and try and catch ourselves on this branch. Okay. We made that branch. We made this branch. More pollen and also another spider baby. Which is obviously the more important of the two. Not that way, no! Oh, okay. I think we need to go down now. More spider babies! There is much pollen here. Why can't I just use the basic pollen? Canopy's peak, 1200 centimeters. We're getting close, boys. Okay, so there's a light thing over there. Let's see where this leads. Oh wait, there's leaves here to fly. I swear guys, sometimes I am not the smartest person alive. <laughs> this is a key example. Over and upwards. Spider baby! I love you, spider babies! Okay. Let's see if we can figure out where we need to go. I'm assuming in here. How far? 500 centimeters! We're almost there, guys! I just want spider babies and to find my way to the top. That is all I care about now. We found it! Hey, can we dance with two of you at once? <gasps> dance party! <laughs> this game is literally the cutest thing I've ever played in my life. Hello, Queen. Welcome to my hive, little spider. I've heard so much about you. Have you brought the pollen from the princess's royal jelly? Oh yes, this shall make a black, powerful jelly. The new princess will be magnificent. Wait here a moment while we prepare her. I am sure she would love to meet you. Alrighty. <laughs> arrived she's so beautiful such powerful wings thank you all for your hard labor preparing my royal jelly dear spider my mother told me of your predicament as i lay in my cell you're planning a rescue mission to a magic island in the sky i can think of no greater adventure with which to stretch my new wings come with me i will take you home and help prepare for our voyage Yes. We get the flight. I'm literally obsessed. This is my new favorite thing in the world. <laughs> this game is too cute to be afraid of anything. Like, it's literally just the cutest thing to ever exist. <laughs> the floor is lava achievement. I'm assuming that's because I, you know, went so far without touching the ground. I don't actually know, though. You there! Hello, my- Oh, no, I'm sorry! <laughs> Dance with me! Okay, he's so cute when he's holding onto the branch. I love him. I'm sorry. 
I seem to have befriended a royal from Canopy's Peak. I expect the bees would be interested in your rescue effort. They've always fancied adventures through the sky. Maybe this new princess will drive out the bird and build her hive over that horrible sky bower. That would be a happy day indeed. That dodge. What dodge? <laughs> Last time I checked, I don't know how to dodge. We need to secure this to this. How, how, how heavy is this? Oh god, this is gonna take forever. We have to be careful to have it even, too. So we're doing one at a time. Slow and steady. Wins the race in this one, boys. Dude, stop falling off. We're slightly off center, which is why I'm recentering. We're making it there, boys. Slow and steady. This will be very secure, for sure. 100% sure. Weighing so much, please. I love the sound when you run into it. Go at work. <laughs> okay, let's make a couple little platforms to work from while we finish attaching this bad boy. Can we attach to this? We can. Thank heavens. The little sounds are so cute. It just sounds like little guitar strings. We're getting close to it being fully attached. We just need to get this side a little bit better now. I think that's pretty dang secure. I think we're just gonna put in, you know, a couple more supports. I don't think this can get like any more secure. Here. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't mean to shoot you. Okay. You. We're dancing. <laughs> oh, this is literally the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. We also need to attach this, though. So. That shouldn't be too terribly difficult. We just need it to be attached. We don't need it to be, like, super close or anything. Okay, so it is lifting up. I wasn't sure if it was going to or not, but now we know. Not you. Not you. I swear. Let me shoot what I wish to game. Please, I beg you. We want it to be equilateral. That is important when you are building anything related to flight. If you have anything wrong... On your flight machine, you will plummet from the sky, and you will die. Flight machines must be very precise. Okay, that's looking pretty good. If I do say so myself. It's a little bit wobbly, but that's fine. A little wobble never hurt anyone. Okay. I don't know where the dung beetles live. I think it said to the west, but I don't know how to actually get there. 
So that would be to the left. So I guess we're gonna go find a route to the left now, because we've been down. We have been to the right. That was the bees and the spider mother. We've been somewhat to the left, but not fully. Okay. Well, if it isn't the mighty predator feeling a little full, let's see if we can free some of those you've imprisoned. Ha ha ha! Fly, my friends! Fly free! Wait, is this going to catch them and... Why... Why would we release them? I'm very confused now. I'm not sure what the whole purpose of catching them is if we're, if we're just going to release them. There's got to be something I missed in here. This has to be where the dung beetles live. Like, that's the only logical thing I can think of. Is that this is dung beetle land, and I'm missing something. Maybe I just need to move those rocks? But how? I could technically pull them this way. That will reduce some of the pressure against this uh, bad boy here. Let's see if we can do something with that. Or perhaps we have to drag it up to the top. That might also be a thing. Now let's slowly pull one of these up to the top. As you can see, there's like the grass patch there. Maybe that's marking something? Because it was a rock that, uh, you know, made it tip in the first place. So maybe if we get a rock to the other side, it'll make it tip back. And that would give us access to something different. I'm assuming and guessing, I do not know for certain, but that is what we are trying now. Let me jump! Jump, spider! Good little spider bro. We can pull the rock all the way over to here. Further up, we're almost past the tipping point. We've started tipping. This, I think this is what we were supposed to do. Let's do this. And we'll get you a little further that direction. Okay. Not quite far enough. We must apply more weight. Can we just pull this down now? We can. Cool. That's so much easier. I think that'll be far enough. Hopefully. Yes! Onwards and up! Nope, that wasn't far enough. I, I, I got deadeded. <laughs> Hopefully that little tiny extra bit will be enough. There we go! I'm assuming water moment? I love this. This is adorable. I am literally obsessed. Can't I like rock it out of the water some way? Yes! Okay, let's go. No! I jumped too high. Okay. Nope, get back up there. So. There we go. Okay. I think we're almost to Dung Beetle Topia. Oh, that was, um, that was a place where I would die. Gotta keep those places out in mind. 
It's gotta keep in mind, you know, dying's a thing that we want to avoid. Ah! This is killing me inside, guys. This is actually difficult. Like, you would not think that in any way, shape, or form, such an adorable game could be this insanely difficult. There we go. That's where I'm supposed to be going. And upwards more. Where's the next one? I guess I can swing back and forth until I find something. There we go. There it was. There's a spot we can tap to there. Actually, not sure where we can go from here. I guess we can try using this to sort of... Yes, there we go. So, if we use this... Ah! Come on, there we go. Let's go. Hey, sleep is for the week. I'm running off five hours for the past two days and it's like 4 a.m. Don't judge me, okay? <laughs> I am an adult. I can make my own adult decisions. Even if they're stupid. Okay. Is there somewhere I can go up there? Okay, is there somewhere that I can pull this down further so that it's more effective? Oh, yes. I can pull all of these things up onto it, I feel. Or maybe I can, like, drag it down? Yes. Maybe? Ha! Can. Probably. I don't actually know if this is doing anything or not. I don't know if I'm supposed to take it down or up. I don't think that really did anything, but we'll see. Let's see what happens if we push it this way. Okay, I think that got us a little more. Getting over, <laughs> over it with Corvel webbed. I feel like we need to get this so much higher up. I, I feel like we have to go up there. That only makes sense that that's where we have to go here. Okay, I wonder. If we get those underneath, does that give it lift? Also, is there anywhere... Okay, so there's this island here in the middle. There's this little air pocket down here. Yeah, it only makes sense that we would have to lift it up, not down. Let's see if we can... Maybe pull it down this way? Okay. Does this work at all? No. I think we have to get more lift by putting these things underneath it on the other side. As you can see, there's a couple traps there. It sort of makes sense if we just, you know, do a uh, drag down. Will these things drag down if I keep on pulling them out? Yes, okay, they will. So we're going to lower them underneath to get them trapped under this branch. Okay, to the right side now. A little bit to the right. And break everything. Okay, one underneath. Let's see if, let's hope that this is actually what we're supposed to be doing. And I'm not just wasting time. But I feel like this is the right move. I feel like we're doing the right thing here. I have absolutely no way to prove this or see if it's true, but it feels right. Okay, so we have to get it to this section. This is what it can actually attach to. And then we need to carefully remove the stuff that's not in the right place. Keep on pulling it around. Okay. Use our laser eyes to push it the correct direction. Ha ha! Another one underneath. Hope this is actually raising it and not just wasting time. Right now, this is more like getting under it than getting over it, though. Not gonna lie. <laughs> so let's keep on lowering you. I wonder if there's actually an oxygen limit. I can't actually tell if there is or isn't. I'm assuming that maybe that thing in our around our head is our like oxygen limit, which would also explain why there is, you know. A, a water thing halfway underneath. But also, I've not seen really any clear sign that I have to have more oxygen yet. Okie dokie. There we go. That was definitely some lift there. Let's see how we're looking up top. I can't tell if we've gotten any further up. Let's go to the top and see. Because there's definitely more stuff over here that we could potentially drag over. But we'll have to see. Am I getting higher up? 
I feel like I might be. Yes! It was just high enough. <laughs> Making progress, boys. Onwards and upwards. There's lots of flies here. Little dung people. Alrighty. Feel like I'm gonna have to fly myself up. Nope, there we go. There's where I was supposed to grab. So, let's rocket myself up, please. Yes, there we go. Feel like I need to go up here. Okay. Have a great day at school, Glenn. Thank you for coming out and stopping before school. Hopefully you have an amazing rest of your day, and I will see you the next time that uh, you're able to make it out for a stream. I do often stream around this time, and I am working on making a actual, like, streaming schedule. So hopefully once that's set in stone, you'll be able to know when to come out. <laughs> okay, so we have a little door here. Is there somewhere where we could attach this? Because, I, I, like, we need to lift the door somehow. Okay, well that worked. <laughs> I don't think that's what we were supposed to do, but that worked. Okay, so there's a chain on that one. I think we just completely managed to cheat something. Warning, landslides. Okay, slide time, boys. <laughs> it's so cute. Please don't let this be the wrong way. If it is, I'm going to be so sad. But this is so cute and so much fun to watch. <laughs> just the sliding as you just rocket your way down is so cute. Okay. We're in Antland? Oh, please tell me no. You know what? We never got this guy out of here. And I just realized that we can attach something to him. I am not always a smart person. I should have known better than to go down the landslide. <laughs> we will soon have you free, my small buddy. Yes, I noticed it's the wrong way. Really, dude? You're, you're not very smart, you know. Come on, my bro. Let's get you out of the pit. Don't fall back into it this time, please. And thank you. Pretty please with ice cream and a cherry on top. Come on. We're gonna get you the rest of the way out of there. One tiny pool at a time. There's so many ropes here. Okay. Let me grab you and drag you up. There we go. We're making progress. I believe in you, dude. No, stop falling. You're walking right now. I can see you walking. <sighs> Thanks for helping me out. You're a true friend. Yeah, I don't regret going back now. Answer engineers, not professors. Okay, um, I sort of forgot how to get out of here. Well... <laughs> yes, let's go dance with him. Little buddy, you're rescued. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, I think it was to the left here. Because it was, you know, by where the... Yes, it's this way. Cool. I somewhat know where I'm going. And I actually know how to move this time. I'm not even drinking water and I'm somehow choking on my own spit. Very attractive, I'm sure. <laughs> ah, this is my life. No regrets. I love this. This is fantastic. Do I have some massive baby spiders on me? I just noticed that. That is actually adorable. I don't know where I'm going. <coughs> oh, it's down, not up. That's why. Someday I shall learn how to truly escape the ant hive. But today is probably not that day. Possibly then. I'm starting to learn how stuff works. Let's go back and see if we can deliver some of these babies to their mother. Thanks for getting these little ones back to me. I'm still looking for the rest of them. 
but together we'll surely bring them all home safely. We're at like 25. That's actually getting creepy. What happens when we dance with you now? Oh, I was hoping the babies would dance somehow. Okay, so we have to go all the way back now. <laughs> Sega Man, um, if you ever see me do something that stupid, please let me know and feel free to chastise me uh, publicly. Uh, I deserve it. Um, I don't want to be resetting every five minutes, so public chastising is allowed and appreciated. Baby's too small. They can't dance. <laughs> I mean, they probably could dance. It's just a matter of should they. Uh, at least we get this satisfying moment again of just flying through the air as we blast our way through this area. Uh, and at least we know how to do everything now. We just have to redo all the actual hard parts. But we have all the easy parts done, so that's good. And onwards and upwards. And through the water. Carefully. Because we don't want to die to spikes. Upwards. Over. Grab this one. Ha ha! Grab this one. Too far! Okay. Grab this one. Jump. Grab that one. Blast off. Grab this one. And to the left. The little small babies are adorable, though. You have to admit that. If any of you disagree that the babies are adorable, uh, we're, we're gonna have some very strong words. Not gonna lie. I keep on dying on the same jump. It is not that difficult, me. Come on, me. You've done this once. You can do it again. I believe in myself. Not really. But I'm going to try my damnedest. <laughs> this is literally just the cutest thing I've ever done in my life. Dude, get back up there. Oh, I keep dying. Someday I will be good at games. Today's not that day, but someday I have goals and dreams and aspirations, and that's just to be decent at video games. Not really, you know, the best of goals, but it's something, and everybody needs something. Even if it's just small, or insignificant, or to be good at video games, it's important to have something. Um, on me, please. There's, there we go. I got it that time. Okay, there we go. Parkour! <laughs> Spider babies are adorable. Okie dokie, artichokey. Onwards! We should be able to make this jump still, because, you know, it's not gotten any further. Come on. There we go. Just made it. Oh. It is a very far trek here. Not gonna lie. By the way, to all of those who are lurking, thank you guys for coming out. Y'all are epic, and I appreciate every one of you. It is really cool to see people come out and just sort of lurk and chat with me while I play video games when I'm a super new streamer because you know normally us new people don't get any viewers <laughs> and it makes me feel like I'm actually doing something somewhat right so thank you guys for that oh yeah we're getting somewhere let's not go the wrong way this time please Okay, almost back to where we were before. We have our candy spider web here, which lets us cheat. I don't think we're able, supposed to be able to do that. Can we open this gate if we go down here? No, I guess we're just gonna be Cheaty McCheaterson. I'm okay with that. Okay, so we don't really have much of a choice except to go down here. Let's try and go slow this time instead of fast. I'm assuming this is the right way. Slow and steady wins the race. Sega, if I start going somewhere wrong, please tell me. I hopefully have low latency on. 
It is not the right way. How, where else am I supposed to go? I'm gonna have to do all that again, aren't I? Yeah, it's definitely not the right way. Ah! I am the big dumb. I'm supposed to go up. Okay. Well, let's go, guys. Take three. Little buddy. <laughs> At least my movement's getting better as I quote-unquote practice and don't totally just fail the same stuff over and over again. Totally not failure, it's practice, everyone. This is planned and anticipated and expected. We're not messing up at all. Uh, totally no cap, no cap at all. <laughs> uh, someday, not today, but someday. We're also starting to learn our way around the spider nest. Goals. And we are out. Up the tree we go again, and then we will be able to- Come on! Little man, please! I swear. Spider boy, we are going to fight one of these days. Ooh, we've caught a few flies. I like that. Catching flies is fun. And fly to the left until we see our little area that we need to go into. Which is right here. Okie dokie. Let's make this happen again. Try number three. Let's see if we can do it the right way this time, guys. I'm assuming my latency is not low enough for me to be getting real-time updates, unfortunately. So that is something that I will be working on, hopefully figuring out what the best way to do settings is for myself and my stream. Because so much to learn still. So much to learn, so little time. Down we go, trying not to die as we swim through the water. And up here up here skills people's skills we are getting them <sighs> okay that was cool i felt like i just did it good guys i don't feel that way often <laughs> look at me i'm man spider <laughs> flying through the sky I love it. Oh, this is literally the most satisfying thing I've ever done in my entire life. Okay, we're supposed to go up, you said, right? Is it up here? Or... Up here? Oh, we, ha we haven't even gone far enough left yet. Okay. So I'm assuming we need to go up some point soon, but not quite yet. Into the water. Up further. That's the daisy. And swing around. Aha! Guilds! Ah, uh, this game makes me feel like I'm actually good at games. I'm messing up a lot. But I'm also learning. <laughs> okay. Almost to the caution landslides. Wait. Do we need to pull this out? That makes sense if we do. What does this do? Ha ha! It lowers the gate and raises the other! Ha ha! I figured out what we're doing wrong! We are not solving puzzles is what we are doing wrong. Or well, rather we weren't solving puzzles, but now we are because we are having big brain moments. Big brain Mega Man 10,000 IQ plays here, guys. You saw it here first. 
100% completed, all solutions, totally legit, nobody helping me sort of gameplay going on right now. <gasps> the Dung Beetles! Hey there, friend! Welcome to Dung Town! <laughs> you know what we gotta do, guys. Are you gonna dance? Are you gonna dance? I'm so upset right now, please. Is that really... You really just, you, you bop your head. Disappointment is what I am feeling right now. Disappointment and slight rage. <laughs> All of this for a head wave. Hello, my good sir. Hi. Hey there, little spider. You heard about dung? Toasty, nutritious, and burns extra hot. You want some? Well, you're in luck. We've got some friends with loads of dung to share. Just, uh, not here. It's up the hill of fairways. And, well, there's one small problem with getting up there. Oh, get to the point, Michael. Look, we need to get across these puddles, and I broke my wing a while back. No flying means we're in need of a walking base solution. Think you could use your fancy web skills to string us a bridge out of them, sticks? Bridge building time! Okay. So first things first, we need to attach the sticks so that we have a good solid base to start with. And then we're going to need one of the sticks to be up towards here. Okay, so there is an extra stick up here. Let's see, do I need it on this side or on the other side? I think I'm going to need, is there anything down here that I can use? Ha! I knew it! I knew they'd be trying to do this to me. Should have known. Come on, little sticky. Of course, it decides to be stupid. I think we need to break this one. Nope. There we go. Why do you do this to me? Just gotta get him over to the side there. Okay. There's one half of the sticks from underneath. Now we need to get the other half of the sticks. Hey, Sega, you see? I'm learning. I do have a brain after all. <laughs> okay, come on. Just come over this direction, please. There we go. Laser eyes! The best part of this game is just shooting everything with our laser eyes. Not gonna lie. So that means you do belong over here. So come on over, my little guy. You're gonna be your top. So, now we need you to get connected to you. No, not like that. Okay. Let's learn to float better first. That might be helpful if we can learn to float. Okay, there's one there. Let's connect you and you now. Cool. We're getting somewhere. Let's pull this a little tighter. We want this to be a nice structurally sound bridge. We don't want any flimsy stuff that's going to fall apart, you know, when they're halfway across the river. We need them to be able to rely on us in our bridge building techniques. you up. Now we need to bring this tip up a little bit. We're a little low. Hopefully this counts as enough of a bridge. No, nope, that's not where I wanted you. We want to attach you further up here. Hopefully they'll be able to get across this. <laughs> I don't actually know what is required for this bridge. Hopefully they just need to be able to walk across it. Is that good enough? We fix up a bridge? Uh, not quite yet. Okay. Well, let's go to the second half. I'm happy with our first half. Now, you... No. Why, why do you like this game? I want this end attached right there thank you that is where i wanted you now 
I want that end attached to that end. Yes! Thank you. Now I want that end attached to that end. Beautiful. Now, I don't know currently if I need this bridge to go up that hill or not. So we're going to go with the assumption of it probably does. Because, you know, they're not known for being fantastic climbers as far as I know. I, I'm not really I'm not really up to date on my beetle climbing abilities. So we're going to go with the assumption of this bridge is probably going to need to take them upwards somewhat. So we're going to do that. We're going to use the extra engineering in ingenuity and all of our years of poly bridge to make a actually decent bridge here. Poly bridge, please don't fail me now. I am needing you. Slowly just raise this portion up. They are all attached to each other, which is good. Because it means I shouldn't have to worry about it getting stuck somewhere stupid. Now we are trying to get down here right now so that we can, you know, wiggle this to the right. Oh, okay. We're just going to better attach you up here. Lots and lots of strands is what we need for this to be a nice, sturdy, reliable bridge. So I'm happy with how this one's going. Now, we need you to be closer together. You're too far apart right now. Okay. Now you guys need to be closer together. So we'll drag these together. Okie dokie. Now, you guys need a stronger connection. Let's see if we can break just this one we don't want there. There we go. Okay. Is there somewhere I can connect this over here? Yes. Okay. Now, the question is, is this a good enough bridge? I don't think it's quite where I want it to be quite yet. So we're going to continue with fixing these until we're happy with how our bridge is looking. We're a little loose here now, so we're going to attach this a little more sturdily here. Okay. This needs to attach to this a little more. Okie dokie! Look at those bridges, guys! Those are some sexy bridges! I'm happy with our construction. Let's give them a test. Yes! Okay. Let's go! Let's see how it goes. I'm gonna ride you. Let's hope that this works. She's making it up! It's taking some effort, but she's making it. Yes, we're using all the big brains right now. A little bit of a drop down there, but it's going okay. She's not falling into the water. Let's hope she can make it up this cliff. This is my biggest concern right here. Come on! Yes! First attempt, baby! Well, thank you so much, little spider. We can head on up now, after a little rest. We won't beat you to the top, but you'll see our friends. You tell them Wendy and Michael sent you. They'll be able to get you all the dung you need. Wait, wait, wait. We got another thing. Oh my god! We have a poop hat, guys. This is... Maximum amazingness. We have become, instead of a carpenter, a poop. So now, we just need to figure out where the heck we're going. And it's somewhere upwards, I'm assuming. Okie dokie. Upwards and onwards. As we figure out how this game works. I love this already. I am so obsessed with this game. <laughs> this is literally just the most enjoyable thing. Yes! Giant poop. <laughs> this is one of the most enjoyable things I think I have ever done in my entire life. And I've done quite a few things. I've flown planes. I've scuba dived. I have done just so many things. And this is honestly one of the most enjoyable. It is soothing. It is entertaining, it has epic music, 
and it is adorable. Who doesn't love this little eight-legged adorable friend? I never thought I'd have a spider for a friend, but I do. Thank you, Fly, for helping me there. Or ground, whichever I grabbed. I wasn't sure if I grabbed the ground or a fly, but I grabbed something. I'm not sure I'm doing this the way it's supposed to be done, but we're doing it A-way. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. No! Oh god, we have to be so careful here. Oh, I love how the music even changes like when you're underwater and stuff. There's just, oh, the sound in this game. Somebody had their work cut out for them and made it happen for real. Whoever made this soundtrack is a auditory genius and I love them. <laughs> ah, this game is amazing. And we just have a tiny turd on our head. Okay, I'm guessing we need some of these rocks. Let's just shoot them until they drop off the edge. Does that make sense? Maybe we need to drag them one at a time, or maybe we can shoot them one at a time. There we go, there's one. Wait, no. I am stopping. I only shot one off. <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Look left. I mean, am I supposed to put them on that? Or am I supposed to like... Ah. Well, I'm assuming... Oh, we need to attach the rocks to the left. That makes sense. Let's get back up. Okay, Roxies. Let's go back to the left. <laughs> Sega, I appreciate you more than you could know. I'm not good at games, so having somebody here that is able to assist me in my, uh, my methods and madness is very useful. You are, you are appreciated. <laughs> I need to make sure I have backseat gaming allowed, turned on on, like, all of my streams, because <laughs> I like backseating. Most people are like, oh, I hate backseating, I hate people spoiling stuff. No, I need it. I appreciate the backseaters, because they make this possible for me. Because without backseat gamers, I would be at a loss so often. And I would mess so much stuff up. So, I allow the backseat gamers to backseat game because they make my life easier and make the overall experience more enjoyable for everyone. <laughs> okay. Let's start pushing more rocks. Go, rocks, go! Move to the left like I tell you to. Okie dokie. Let's grab you and attach you there. Downwards you go. Good little Roxy. And we'll grab some more of y'all. Let's just attach you to here, put you over the edge, and then we can attach you to our actual uh, raft thing from there. Actually, you know what? You should be fine. Let's keep on adding. Hopefully I don't need them all, because if I need them all, I might have doomed myself. Ooh, I think I dropped some stuff. Hopefully that's enough rocks. Because <laughs> the other one was, yeah, over here somewhere, and it's, it's, yep, yeah, okay, so that was enough to get it to the bottom. So hopefully now, when we go up here, aha! Progress, I think. <laughs> I'll learn what is and isn't progress eventually. Just not quite yet. The level designs in this game, though, you have to admit, they are cool as shit. I've seen a lot of level designs, and this is some of my favorite. Just because the sheer variety, and, like, it's feels like you're actually making progress every time you do something. 
so many games don't give you that positive reinforcement nowadays and you'll just sit there and you'll rage at something for hours on end and not be able to make any progress and you'll just feel like you're the dumbest person alive and then you come to a game like this where there's small little missions it's enjoyable it's adorable and you're just able to go and get so much done i don't think i'm supposed to go down there am i supposed to go down sega man do i go down <laughs> I'm scared to go down anywhere now after that last debacle. <laughs> okay, I do go down. Sega, you're my new favorite human being. No! Oh, okay, this is going to be a bit of a pain. Let's go hardcore focus mode, guys. Oh, stop. Enjoy myself? I am enjoying myself. I just don't like repeating the same stuff over and over again. Because also, I, I am still recording this. So I do want content to actually be fun. Because you guys probably don't enjoy seeing me go to the ant colony 17 times in a row. Because <laughs> I literally would have made that mistake a dozen more times if you hadn't informed me of it being a mistake. <laughs> I'm not the best when it comes to understanding, like, what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> okay. Let's see if we can figure out where we're going. Oh, it's so smooth. Okay, in we go. You never know, we might like it. <laughs> if you want to see me fail, I am more than happy to. I'm going to do that plenty anyways, but yes. Howdy, spider! Wendy and Mike sent you, did they? You must be here for the bounty of dung. We got some for you right on over here. Only problem is this dung is a little too comforting. Our lazy son is simply refusing to leave the ball. It's hot out there. Why would I want to leave? Little spider, it's all yours if you can convince him to get out and see a bit of the world. Go on, give it a little push. <laughs> a little push, you say? <laughs> yes, please. Go on. We <laughs> We're done writing. Oh, I love this. This is amazing. <laughs> this is my new favorite thing to do in the world, guys. Dung writing. It is the new type of bull race, bull writing, where you just write a piece of dung. Oop. Well, we fell. There we are. No! My dung! I was doing so well! <sighs> I'm sad now. I've been so close to being on that the entire time. Did I seriously just get kicked out of home? I'll just have to live here now, I guess. Help yourself to some dung. It's my favorite. Very energy dense. <laughs> okay. So we're going to flip this lever back. Hopefully pull this dung out of the way in time. And then... When that comes back, we have dung all prepared to go on top of it. So now we're going to very carefully attach this very securely to the base. See, I know what we're doing on this one, Sega. I understand this. <laughs> and now we're going to flip the lever. And catch a ride to the top. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is so pleasant. This is, this is so enjoyable. Oh, delightful. How, how simply pleasant that was. Such a lovely experience. Now, we need to get him into the dung receptacle. So, we are going to use you to lift him up while we cut him loose from the bottom. Then, we are going to very carefully lift this man into position, but also put him in a place... Where we do not have to worry about cutting the wrong thing. Because that is a very big concern I have right now. Okay. We're getting you in place. Come on, my little man. Into the dung receptacle. 
Alrighty. Oops, a daisy. Other side, too. Eventually, he'll get in there. We'll just have to go back and forth a little bit until we get him in. And bottom up. Alrighty. If they come out with a workshop for this game, I will literally play this non-stop. Okay, so what is left? So we need to get the, we need to patch it. Um, we have the fuel, we have the engine, we have the spider webs holding it up, we have the platform. We just need to patch this somehow. And I'm not sure what was the plan on patching this. Let's talk to these. So this is the balloon that's supposed to take us to the magic island in the sky. I'll never make it in this con it'll never make it in this condition. Let me fix that up for you. Ah, oh, yes. Let's go, Queen uh, Princess B. Oh, I love her. Ta-da! We shouldn't have any problems now. These wax patches are completely airtight. Um, little buddy, is it ready? Looks like the airship is ready to launch! Are you ready to head out? It might be a while before we can return. I'm ready. All right, comrade! Igni engine ignition in three, two, one! Lift off! We did it! Oh, I love this. I love this so much. <laughs> we Sega, I think you're enjoying this game just as much as I am, and I appreciate that fact. <laughs> We're just sort of slowly watching this rise into the sky. Our platform's not perfectly level, so there's a, a bit of interesting look to the platform at times. <laughs> as it loses perfect symmetry and goes on an angle. I love it. <laughs> uh, I love our little poop hat. We can dance right now. Yes, dance party on the airship. Oh, Sega, don't be scared of heights. It'll be okay. We're having a dance party, see? <laughs> don't be scared of heights and of the thunderstorm we're rising through. <laughs> We're just going to dance through it all. Hey, we have airtight and I'm assuming watertight wax patches. We'll be just fine. I'm sure of it. We're not going to lose anybody here or anything like that. I'm totally not going to tether myself to the base here. <laughs> Whoa, this storm was not on our forecast, but the ship is still holding barely. We're gonna hop on, hold on for dear life, and we're gonna dance on our tightrope. <laughs> I love how we're just having a dance party in the sky while fighting for our lives and to rescue my lost lover. Like, it's so, it doesn't line up, but it works in a way. <laughs> the graphics in this game are amazing. The wind is really picking up now. I feel so alive! Ooh, what's this? Ah, uh, this is cool. Now I see what they mean by the special island. Oh, cool! We have a little snack up here. I'm gonna go eat. Delicious! <laughs> Nothing like going for a snack on the way. This is it! The Sky Power! The airship won't be able to make it any further with this storm raging. You'll have to continue without us. Go, find your love. We'll meet you on the other side. Yes, the other side. That's exactly what I want to hear right now, because the other side totally isn't another way to say death. What are these? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Maybe I need to put one of you in here? In here, my good sir. 
I'm assuming that's what I need to do. That's what makes sense based off of my current situation. Yes! I was right! Yes, eat all of the flies. I'm hungry now, though. Not gonna even lie. I have not eaten much today. Ooh, that was not the right move. <laughs> oh, dude, I wish I had a Taco Bell nearby. My closest Taco Bell is like a 15-minute drive and definitely closed right now. It's not a 24-hour one. Oh, that was a... Uh... You know, the background platforms really get to me when I'm not expecting them. Alrighty. Okay, so, okay, so it's up there. So let's hope that it respawns, maybe? Can we get another one, please, game? I messed up! Do we have another one back here that we can steal, maybe? Please, game? Oh god, I think I messed up, guys. How do I get that back? I hate the look of this flying rock. Unfortunately, they look like candy I hate from my childhood. Okay, so, um... Did, how, how bad did I mess up here, Sega? Okay. So I found it. But this is going to be the biggest pain in my butt I have ever done in my entire life. I have to blind fire and hope that I can grab the one thing I need, which is incredibly far down. Okay. We did it, boys. I don't know how, but we did it. Over we go. Up into your thing, please. Follow me. No. Up. Please get in to your nest. There we go. Oh. That rock I was not expecting to be down there. I'm glad it was. Come on. Bad. I don't know if I'm supposed to be going up or down. I'm assuming down. Do I have to like bring this platform with me? Is that what I'm doing now? I think that's what I have to do is move this platform. This is nerve-wracking. This is getting, like, hardcore platforming now. Let's get on our rope. Our rope seems slightly more steady. Okay. I think I understand what we're trying to do here. I'm just not 100% certain. Okay. We should be able to just shoot down there now. Yes. Okay. Now, uh, where's a rock? Can I pull you out, maybe? Can you get pulled out? I'm not sure where we're supposed to get the rock from this time. Is there a rock I'm missing somewhere? Don't see one down there. I mean, it could be possible the platform itself is going to serve as the rock. That makes some sense. So we'll try dragging you all the way over. Okay. Continuing on. This is the only logical explanation I can think of as to how we're going to get a rock over here. Because I don't see any others. I do like puzzle games, though, so that's nice, at least. Will this work? Yes, it works. Okay. Aha! I have a brain. Does not always work great, but I do have one. I know this will have to come with us. And we have to be careful not to lose it as it likes to fly off. I'm assuming we have to, yes, drag it down here. Come further down, please. And let's break this. 
And you need to get dragged over. Come on over. Get you into your little cubby hole there. Really? You're gonna be like that? There we go. Oh god, there's multiples. I'm scared. First thing we're gonna do is attach you guys together so I don't lose you. And then we're gonna drag you. And hope that we're doing the right thing. Drag you down. Right, thing attaching you up there. Let's scout ahead and see. Oh, I dropped too far down. <laughs> ah, this is actually insanely difficult. Where am I supposed to be going here? Am I supposed to be going to the side? I'm assuming so. And then it pushes me over. And then one there. Do we only need one of the rocks? I'm not sure. We'll find out soon enough. I'm taking both. And I'm not risking losing it. I press right click instead of left. Eventually we'll learn. Come on back up, you little rocks. You over here, please. Where's anything over there? There we go. Better. Rocks. You. Somewhere. There we go. That works. more along the lines of what I was going for. Get you attached there. No. We have a lot of spider webs to break right now. There we go. No. <laughs> We're dying. <gasps> Goodbye, C C Sagam Hand. I appreciate you coming out. I will see you the next time you manage to make it out. And thank you just once again for coming out. I had a really good time talking with you, dude. It is always nice to have people that like to chat. So, no! Get back here! Stupid rocks. You're making me break the. This game is infuriating. Grab onto the branch. Break the right thing. There we go. You. We need you to come up here. You. Up. Very good. Infinity stones. Yes, they do rather look like an infinity stone. It is rather unique how they appear. Okay. Oops, a daisy. Oh, you have a strand down here I don't want you to have. This way! Up, and then this way, please. Come on. <laughs> we made it! Okay, we have another lovely little rock here. And decided to attach himself where he, would, he doesn't need to be attached. Okay. Come with me, little Roxy. Beautiful. <gasps> it's our little buddy! Hello, boyfriend! <gasps> we can dance together! <gasps> We're so happy! Happy now. It's so cute. We just need one rock now. Uh, which rock can we take with us? I need one that I can put over here. Oh my god, he counts as a rock! And when we dance, he follows us! <laughs> this is the cutest damn thing I have ever seen in my life. <laughs> I thought the rest of the game was cute. I was wrong. I had not seen this before. Oh, little buddy, are you struggling? Here, let me make you a nice little path. 
There we go. Who's a good boyfriend? You are. You are, little buddy. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. No. Come on, little buddy. I'm going to have to mute here for a second, but I will be right back. Should be just a moment before we're back, guys. So bear with me and we'll get back to the stream.
and we are pretty much back. Alrighty, sorry guys, I am back. Had to leave for a second there. Okay. Little buddy, come on, you can do it, I believe in you. This way. There we go, good little buddy. No! Okay, we're gonna obviously need to make a change here. Little buddy, little boyfriend. There we go. Now we are making progress. Follow me, little boyfriend. Using Q and uh, A at the same time is a little awkward, not gonna lie. Oh, great. The Curse Alice. This, this music just got much darker, much quicker. Not a great sound. Little boyfriend, come. Yes, be the little guy. Oh, great. No! Okay. Okay, so there's a secret underneath path. Come on, little boyfriend. We will find all of the secret paths and keep you safe. Ah, this is nerve-wracking. We're gonna have to find all of the little ways to keep him safe now. We're gonna need a path up. Come on, little boyfriend! I believe in you, you can make it up! Can you not? Really? Come on, you can do it, little boyfriend. We can make it out of here. I believe in you. Oh, frick. That's not good. Uh, we can bring the pipe up and around, maybe. Maybe that's what we're supposed to do. Just pipe them up. The physics on these pipes is so weird. Okay, come on, little boyfriend. We can do it. We can make it out of here. Oh, nope, stop, stop, stop. Little boyfriend, why did you get stuck? Oh, well, that's not a good place. <laughs> okay. Not sure what we're supposed to do here. Maybe just make a really thick band of stuff that he can't get through. I'm not sure how easy it is to get through these spider webs. Or maybe we can fling... Oops, sorry, boyfriend. Maybe we can fling this through. We'll have to see here. Let's see. Can we shove this down there? That does make it harder for him. Let's see if we can get this attached to where he can't get up. Okay. We're getting somewhere. Oh, that was close. That is spooky. I think that's what we have to do. Nope, that's not working. Maybe we just have to attach it better? Nope, we got eaten. It's timing! Okay, I figured it might be. We have a really nice bridge here now. Let's wait for the bird to come up and then we will go. Come on, little boyfriend! Make a nice dirty path so we don't have any issues coming up. Oh, that was close. Go away. Okay. Moving onwards. Oh, frick. We have to go up here. No! I messed up. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing here, guys. Okay, so there's the bird. Where's our boyfriend? There's the boyfriend. Okay. We wait on the bird, then we go on. We dance with our adorable little boyfriend. We will hopefully not get eaten. Okay. Come on, boyfriend. 
boyfriend. I think this is good. No, it's not. It's not. It's not good. Oh, that could have been bad. Come on, little boyfriend. Oh, great. Now we gotta do puzzle solving in the middle of all of this. Okie dokie. So, time to raise up this gear. Uh, this could be a bit of a pain. I swear, I cannot do good right now. <laughs> this is actually more difficult than I expected it to be. Which is pretty sad because I was expecting it to be difficult. Okay, come on, boyfriend. He ain't my boyfriend! That is not right! My boyfriend is struggling, for real. Can you please make your way up here, boyfriend? Come on, you can do it! There we go, who's a good boyfriend? Really? Why are you struggling this badly? Come on. Follow me! Oh, come on, I had that! Yeah, that was my bad. <laughs> oh, come on, boyfriend! Why are you so bad at existing? Literally, just climb up the damn spider web! Oh, well, there I got eaten. At least my boyfriend's back. Come on, boyfriend! You oh, frick. I fell. We're probably dead here. Yep. This is more difficult than you think when you're having to use the Q button while walking and you have to press up and left at the same time or else you lose your boyfriend. Which we just did again. Come on, boyfriend. You can do it. Come on. I believe in you. We can make it. There we go. Who's a good boyfriend? You're not. <laughs> I feel sort of mean for that one. But he also sort of deserves it. He's so useless. All he does is dance and try not to, and, like, die. That could have been bad. Okay, there we go. Activate the lever. Make a nice little platform for boyfriend to come up with me. Okay. Boyfriend, let's go. <laughs> this is more difficult than I thought it would be, but I also am still loving it. Little spider, you made it! And you rescued your boyfriend! We're almost ready to go home! Vlad is just bringing the airship around now. Wait! He's coming! Watch out! Big scary bluebird. No! My boyfriend! This is web. It is amazing. Oh, he is not getting away with that again. Hold on, little spider. We're going to catch this. him, but I'm not really sure how. And I keep getting absolutely punted backwards. Can I get over the front of him? I want to get on top of him. Can I, like, web his beak shut? Okay, there we go. I'm on top of him now. I don't know what I'm doing! I'm 
Am I supposed to be catching him to something? Well, he's attached to the B now. Is this correct? <laughs> I'm so confused. Do I need to attach, connect his, attack his feet? We'll see. Well, there's a handy dandy little perch right there underneath his batukas. We shoot his face. Okay. Save me, bee buddy. Where did the burb go? There's the burb. We will hang on to him for dear life. Our bee buddy will save us again, though. Okay. We're lucky we have a beast buddy like lifeline here. Out our bee buddy, we would be very dead right now. <laughs> Onwards and upwards we go. Ah, too far. Where is he? It is so hard to keep track of where he is. Even when you're like on top of him, it's very difficult. <laughs> oh, come on! Keep on just following. Ant-Man going up Thanos' butthole with that strategy. We're going down! Sorry we're late, comrade. Just picked up a little help on the way. Hey, neighbor. Megan one reporting for duty. This beast doesn't stand a chance. We're coming in close now. You'll have to pull the Megan onto the bird's back with your webs. Let's do this. All right, let's see. Okay, so we're gonna need to navigate down to here. But we're on the mech ant now. Where's the bird? There we go. So, we have them tethered now. Now we just need to pull them closer. Mech ant to the burb! Dude, get back up there, me. I'm struggling. Let's get on the top. Okay, keep pulling him closer. Let's see, we want the head to the head. We're slowly getting there. It's just gonna take us a little while. And a lot of webs. But they're very well attached right now. <laughs> and we're just going to keep getting them more and more attached until the ant actually manages to defeat this giant bird thing. I guess a bluebird is the bluebird from Helvo because it keeps stealing my boyfriend. I'm in position! Get clear! Detaching backhand! No! <laughs> Go backhand with the intros that we helped make. <gasps> yeah, shooting his face is better than trying to enter his ass, but that's very true. <laughs> By the way, Isaiah, I missed you there, but hi, Isaiah, how are you doing today? We can just keep shooting his face, which is beautiful. Let's hop up here, see what he has to say. We did it! The beast is grounded! What should we do with him now, comrade? We send him away! You hear me, bird? You've burnt all your bridges here! The bugs of this bush will not put up with your eating and kidnapping their friends. And now we have the means to defend ourselves. You need to find a new land to call home. Maybe somewhere far away from here with more birds like you. Maybe somewhere you can finally find a friend. But you leave now. Before I change my mind. Let's see if the bird's actually smart enough to leave. Oh, looks like he is. I'm good, boy. Oh my, that was scary. I wasn't sure I'd be able to talk to him, but I did it. Thank you, buddy. And thank you too, buddy's boyfriend. Don't thank my boyfriend. He did nothing but get in the way. Your brave actions gave me the courage to finally stand up to that menace. Our home is a little bit safer today, thanks to you. <laughs> okay. 
This is the first time in my entire life I have ever finished an entire game in one sitting. <laughs> I didn't get up for a second there, but that's just because my roommate got up and I needed to uh, take care of the dogs real fast because they were going crazy in the background. I'm probably You probably weren't able to hear it because of where they were, but yeah. So yeah, that was webbed everyone. Hopefully you enjoyed that as much as I did. This is probably going to take top spot as my all-time favorite game it is just it was it was yeah that was a really good game i have never seen any sort of mechanics like that i literally felt like spider-man once i got the hang of it i hate that i went through the first half of the game not knowing how to actually use movement but yes everyone thank you so much for coming out you all are all amazing hopefully you have a wonderful rest of your game day and i will see you all the next time that we stream actually it looks like there might be something at the end here because you can fast forward but let's see if there is yeah oh look there's a new little pink birdie <gasps> wait 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 we got something we can mirror our boyfriend i actually don't even want that can i take it off Thank you. Frick you, boyfriend. But yeah, I'm assuming that we can go through. Yeah, we can go through and probably find all of the collectibles and stuff that we missed throughout the game. Because there are still some that we have not gotten. Yeah, we're back here at the beginning of the game. So, if you guys want to play this for yourself, do try and find the collectibles. I will be putting a link in the chat right now where you guys can go and check out the game. It is on Steam and is pretty epic. So check it out if you guys are interested in getting webbed for yourself. So once again, thank you guys for coming out and watching. Thank you Indie Game Collective for hooking me up with this and letting me play this amazing game. And I look forward to seeing you all the next time that we stream. Drop a like. Uh, <laughs> this might be going up on YouTube. If it does, drop a like there. Otherwise, uh, drop a subscription if you're new. And have a great rest of your day, guys.